What's good, everybody? Welcome to the Ball Don't Lie podcast. We have a very, very good episode in store for you guys today. This is a trade deadline episode. I don't think we're going to even have time to talk about anything else because we didn't even talk about the Kyrie trade yet. So we got to get started with that. Or LeBron's thing. What LeBron? Oh, the the record-breaking. Record-breaking. We'll get into that. We will get into that. But it's a crazy episode. A lot of things happen. Um... So let you, you guys want to start with the trades or you want to start with the LeBron thing and then no, go around. LeBron. I think we talk about LeBron, LeBron first because yeah, yeah. there's a lot of I'm trades. LeBron first and always. Okay, well, <laughs> we're all here to give LeBron his flowers. Does anyone have a little like? Oh, nope. that's it. Oh, I want to say this. Do you guys think that he's the greatest scorer of all time? That LeBron James is the greatest scorer of all time now. I think that depends on whose so. whose opinion on scoring is was valued like is determined wise. Do you do you label it like scoring like being able to score or yeah he scored the most points but you take it, all of that into account. Greatest yeah, greatest ever. Why though? Because he has the most points. Undeniable yeah. So it was like was the, at the end of the day scoring is the is the art of getting points. But he did have a pretty good yeah, career he, like healthy. Yeah, sorry, bro. Who else? Who else right. averaged twenty? Oh. Over above twenty the entire career. I know that shit's actually a wild. lot of people. Jordan, I would say Jordan's not sure. as long. Nobody, but it's health has yeah, to be a big factor. The, he's not averaging co- more. Sorry. The reason LeBron he's is a rookie averaging twenty something, and he never averaged less. The, the reason again. the reason LeBron though is the all time scoring leader is obviously the longevity. Like he is a good scorer, but he's not the greatest scorer. I, I've seen yeah. people could score better than him, but that doesn't mean he's a bad scorer. Like yeah. people think just because he's not like. A considered a scorer he can't he, he's a bad scorer he can't it's not true he just there are players that are strictly more focused on getting buckets and i've seen him score in a myriad of ways like jordan and kobe i think are better bucket getters than him but all around players are not as good as lebron so yeah i forgot about kobe too he's always been a pass first player also he's never been on LeBron, like, yeah initially, yeah so like a score but imagine, okay, okay, but it's like imagine if lebron's only objective like because some people really go out there and say like oh i'm just a scorer like last yeah, year yeah. and this year <laughs> Nah, it's only it's, objective it's, is to score. He started averaging 30. He could have been... He, you think he yeah, been but he's doing not winning this, games, though. But you think he could have been doing this fucking... Yeah, no, but when it comes to just scoring, you think he could have been doing this when he was younger? No. If he can do this right now, you don't think he could have been averaging 30. I, it's possible, no, I don't but he wouldn't so. do it because... I think he improved No, no I'm age. saying, like, well, yeah, if he just wanted to score. Yeah, yeah, if he right. just wanted to score. Ooh, Bron, Bron. LeBron. If he was just like, oh, if, if, if he felt like, oh, I'm just a scorer, you know? I don't got to focus on the rebounding passing. All he cared about was scoring. Seeing as he right now he's like obviously trying to score more and he's averaging thirty he at thirty eight. It wouldn't uh, imagine if he was twenty. I mean, after trying to score, he could shoot trying up. to score as much as after, possible. No, he was trying to score at twenty eight. Yeah, in Miami, he, like, he was. They 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 said still, LeBron, like, you got to be the scorer. That's what Dwayne Wade told him. Yeah, yeah, yeah but yeah. he still had to be the. He still. You're averaged saying if he was like, chasing like, baskets, it wouldn't lead to as many accomplishments as he wanted. In he's great because he plays team basketball. Yeah, that's but okay. But I'm just saying, like, he wouldn't be LeBron without. Pat yeah, being the guy that he is. Passing. Obviously, he would, be LeBron, but I'm saying, he would be. I think people would regard him. Have, oh, he's like one of the greatest scorers. If would. he was only trying to score, no, I still wouldn't. Because it's like the way that he scores the basketball isn't the same way that. But I'm not the shooter that the, the other guys. Are. Gabe had a like, good point. The technicality way, like the technicalities, or the okay, fundamentals well, well, that they have. To, what's more important? Is what's like, more important, the skill or the fucking effectiveness? Skill matters. Back to though. Gabe's Back question: the effectiveness. What do you value? What do you value? Nigga can have most most crazy skills like. It doesn't matter if, if they're not effective like, at scoring the ball. They are. Kevin Durant has the highest field goal percentage, I think, yeah, ever. Yeah, KD's He's amazing. a better scorer than LeBron James, is he not? Okay, but, like, I'm just saying, like, well, LeBron is still doing in. everything. KD is oh, I'm a scorer. When I was saying LeBron can't KD do those said, things. KD oh, I'm a scorer. But, so, like, he's, KD's not trying to, you know, he gets the ball, nigga, I'm scoring. <laughs> you know what? <like, laughs> what is this? <laughs> LeBron, he, yes, uh, like what fucking orchestrating the offense. What just happened? That slow shit down. He's orchestrating. Book, 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 book. book, book. The book. What? What do you say? I'm talking about LeBron. Kidding, kidding. I'm talking about LeBron. Like he he orchestrates the offense. Yeah, you're saying he's their roles there, are different, basically. Yeah, but I'm, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like Katie's main job has always he's been to score. Really good at scoring. Yeah, nice. but uh, okay. If LeBron James is at the high level like Katie was scoring. He, they probably probably do the same what, thing. What too. are their career averages though? Okay, twenty-seven, seven, and seven is LeBron's, and uh, Katie's like twenty-seven. He's a bit one like lower, but I'm still trusting so, like, Katie when, for the last basket. Like, okay, though, like, but how do you? But why? That's why. Huh? Like when he's, it comes to career better stats, fundamentally at scoring, he still sc- he scores. He averages the same exact amount I, as this dude. You say is everything is now. Nice, Trey Young's probably the top five player in the league. If we're talking no, about stats, it, I have a question. It's not just stats, but how are you? Okay, it's just this. We're talking about oh, it's this dude's skill and effectiveness. Mm-hmm. It's like okay, yeah, but LeBron is literally averaging the same amount for his career. As the guy you say has the most skill and the most effectiveness. Who are you saying? Okay. LeBron has done it for 20 years. All right, what's your question, Isaac? And he does everything else on the floor and not just trying to score. Let, KD let, is a pure scorer. 
Yeah. It, it, that's that's what he's trying to say, shit. though. That's, and I'm saying, if you think if LeBron was only not not trying to orchestrate the offense... You wouldn't be able to score like Kevin Durant can. Like, the way that, that Kevin Durant does it fundamentally... Okay, but LeBron I'm saying, won't be and LeBron, LeBron's, LeBron's not, not as an efficient free throw shooter or three point shooter as Kevin Durant. That goes into being a better scorer. Free throw margins yeah, are crazy. LeBron's like a crazy sixty five. Like, like, you can sag off LeBron when he was a, uh, when he was young. It's different. Yeah. Okay, but regardless, like if he's LeBron doing, ain't never dropped eighty one. Facts, facts. facts. <laughs> That's a fact. Facts. That is a fact. Fuck. He ain't even dropped seventy one. He didn't drop seventy one. Facts. Facts. What was what was uh what's Kobe's like highest triple? We're talking, we're talking about scoring, 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 scoring. Yeah, he yeah. lost. <laughs> I'm just saying though. But if, I'm just if saying, he could have broke that record though, you don't think he would have? He for sure would have if he could have. LeBron, like the 80 one game. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can't, you yeah, can't tell me. Like, you can't tell me can. game one of the finals where JR choked can. that he wasn't trying to score as much points as possible. He also had a triple double. But he has other attributes to to say that he is the greatest scorer. Like for instance, he has like I don't finish the points. My point about KD versus LeBron is mainly Ron has the ball in his hands and it's like time is being used up. When Katie gets the ball, his main objective yeah, score. is to score. I understand like, your point. It's like, but the reason it's Katie, like you're arguing for us. Yeah. Like, you're the arguing for Katie. That's position. all I'm saying. <laughs> I'm is, saying, but I'm saying LeBron is okay. He, I'm not saying no, he's the most skilled. Point. I'm not saying he's the most like you know. But I'm then, saying he's, he we're supposed to give LeBron LeBron his flowers and it's talking about trades and what happens. Okay, but I'm saying he's the greatest because he not the greatest scorer. Let him talk first. He's the most points. You said it the whole time. Let him finish speaking at least. Is this like at the end of the day, effectiveness is scoring the ball? He's done it more than anyone. I get his point. So what do you I like? And make he, your point. And we'll he move also on. averages a bunch. All he's like, saying, no, but I mean, I get your like, point. That's he, why I would say he's the like, greatest. Same way people say, oh, Jordan doesn't have every single greatest stat, but oh, he's the greatest because yeah, he's what six he did and zero. Yeah. Prime. Compared okay, but Jordan's prime and compared to LeBron's prime, like if Jordan, if Jordan, Jordan didn't career. retire three we'll years, he would be all time leading scorer. Greatest career. Would look at that. If you're gonna say someone's the greatest, how can you now not say talking about something greatest? else? We're talking about some whole different. The first question he asked was, "Who's is you can't LeBron even the, say the greatest?" Score? LeBron has the greatest yes. career because he lost in the final six the times. Best. His you scoring is not because career. he's more that, skilled. No, it's his his all, based off though. longevity. No, I'm, but I'm saying uh, the scoring, the span of his career. Not, I'm not saying his career. Span of his career. Just because he scored the most baskets doesn't mean you're the greatest scorer. Just have the record. Because he scored most. Kareem, the greatest scorer. Nobody said Kareem ever was the greatest scorer ever. The nigga was averaging like fucking 30, 30. Carmelo's number, number three, hey, the third best scorer. If we came scorer up ever. here, if we came up or here and said, besides LeBron, is Kareem the greatest scorer? He would not say yes to that. <laughs> yeah. He know damn well he not saying yes. Yeah, say Kyrie a better scorer. Better scorer. Nah, 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 I'm not gonna say he Kyrie's a better scorer. By his logic, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah but I'm not gonna say Isaac. Who do you think it is? No, no. Give let's all say something about LeBron. We don't gotta argue if someone's better than him right now. We just want to say. Congrats, he yeah. has a crazy accomplishment. Yeah. Like, a we're crazy not trying point. to say, we're not, it's not. a ton of points. That teared up watching <laughs> that crap. What? It's inspiring watching, for watching real, bro. Where the basket? That video where they showed like his like young self coming Yeah, I'm saying that commercial school. was fire. I was like, uh, like 10 out of 10 commercial. Right? Thinking of all that adversity. So, so many good TikTok really edits out of it too. I swear to God, it gets with tears, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the chosen one, bro. Man had, seconds, man had a nickname called the chosen one before he was drafted. Bro had to have a Hall of Fame career or bust. Like he needed to be like like. That's what makes it crazy. He exceeded man. expectations. I would say. And the hardest expectation, and he exceeded it. Because I watched that video where he's talking about. Uh, Wiggins, oh. and he's like, did he live up to expectations? He's like, yeah, he did, because he was still good, right? And then, then LeBron exceeded them bitches, <laughs> if that's the case. Hey, man, don't talk about Higgins, Wiggins, of Andrew like that. Higgins, Wiggins, of Andrew. Anything, anybody want to say anything else about LeBron before we go to these trades? I mean, he's nice. I just, I want to say some. I want to say <laughs> my opinion of, about something. We got to get a LeBron jersey up here. Bro. I didn't, like, I didn't like him for a long before you I to still, Lakers, bro, yeah. I just yeah, well, I respect when he was on the Heat, when he was on the Heat, he was a villain. If you're a Laker fan, you hate LeBron. That's what it was like. I don't know if it was like for anyone else. If growing up Lakers, a lot of my yeah. Armenian, like anyone, all the boys, my homies, everybody hated LeBron. They call him the flopper. They call him the fish. They call. Yeah, at one point, at one point, I didn't like him either. Because the rivalry to Kobe, like, people didn't want to. Yeah, yeah, but in the early 2010s, Kobe was the winner. You know, LeBron wasn't the winner Kobe yet. He was the man. No, I'm like, saying that's why they. Don't yeah, yeah, like yeah, yeah. It was just like he was on the. But the thing is, Everyone we hated LeBron because he was the big challenge team. in the East. But he never, he never met Kobe in the finals. But unfortunately, that's gotta be more to him, right? Because when you think that's about LeBron, for. you think about like, oh, he's gonna make plays, playmaking, gonna, like, smart decision get his points, but he's gonna make plays, right? Yeah. But damn. Think about every other accolade player, or like every other category that he's like up there. He's in these top, top five. Yeah, exactly. 
Rebounds. Oh, he's top ten in every gotta be top ten three. He's gonna drive forty. Rebounds. Forty k, ten k, ten k. Watch. It's easily that's obviously. Point that I, was I get it. I get it. Uh, I get it. But the thing is that like, Kobe he dropped eighty one points. That's wild. <laughs> that's why you could say wild. you have a conversation. You can say whatever you want. LeBron's played how many games and in all those games fake. he's never been able to beat that. No, but see, like you could say LeBron. You could say LeBron is the best basketball player ever, but you can't. I don't think you could say he's the best scorer ever. I cannot. There's not. The there's a better argument of him being an overall better basketball player than anybody else because he could do like, anything. Play one like through five. Like his longevity is like like a knock. Like why is Ooh, that a knock on him? Who? Nobody said that's <laughs> one of his greatest like, strengths. Oh, what, yeah. he, but he did it like it took him Dude, twenty they're, years. They're oh, they're no, no, no. We're just they're talking about like, scoring. The all-time scoring list is because think, of longevity. No, but I think him being able to like because people don't take care of themselves like he does either. I mean, yeah, that's like he's not. He can't get commended for. I feel like we are commending. I feel like the health. You I feel like the health thing is kind of a luck based thing too. What if in like year thirteen? No. What if in year thirteen he threw a torn ACL? Or like in KD, like he he came back, point. but I'm saying like he never had a major had a injury game. ever yeah. Yeah. until like growing in the Lakers. But yeah. up Ross until that point, that's reason. what I'm saying. Point, I'm saying it luck. could happen. It like it happened to KD's ACL tear. Kobe had like a well, like that shape like that or more prone to getting like injured. everybody knows he spends more money on his body than anybody. I get what you're saying, but an injury is an injury though. You know what I'm saying? But it's not. I'm not saying it's. I'm saying it could happen. Not always. If not you train always. Your body not everyone. Well enough, you, that, that's why they train. Invincible. So well. mm. They're not gonna be invincible. That's what I'm saying. Like he could have gone injured, and he could have been different. injury. He's had ankle injury. There's yeah, a Rion yeah. Zion always so gets injured. There's a reason AD always get injured. But I'm saying he yeah. took care of himself so that's, well. Like, Other people, never... like Shaq, that nigga. That's why he came so fucking fat and <laughs> it hey, became ass because the nigga didn't take care of himself. Fuck today. I don't know. I love Shaq, but Shaq would tell you that. Shaq is. I got that from Shaq's interviews. Yeah, yeah. I didn't. I didn't make it up. Yeah, he. I don't know. A big injury? I don't know. I can't remember. Yo, not, not hurt like I mean, that. not crazy. Maybe post time. Probably post Lakers. He did. Definitely when he was yeah, like 30 slower. plus. He got sure. slow and fat. Like, because he wasn't taking care of him. <laughs> no, but he's yeah, been. Yeah. I got one more like, question. You saw, how, you saw how built he was when he was on the Magic? Yeah, yeah. Nigga looked like yeah. fucking uh, Superman. David Robinson. Oh, shit. Like, Do you think that the record is ever going to be broken for LeBron? No, shot. Sure. <laughs> no way. Does it say anything about I mean, Kareem? They asked no, Luca. They asked Luca. Luca plays 20 plus seasons, but he's not. No, 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 no. They asked Luca. He said, Can you break it? He said, I ain't playing that fucking long. <laughs> exactly. Like, niggas, like these the, days, uh, I feel like people aren't going to He's play still going, too. He got two more years at Plus least. Plus, the sitting, too. Like, the back to back sitting. Yeah, they, No, they he's not going to play 80 games. They might shorten the season for all we know, like, in a few years, and then it's for sure impossible. Uh, witness history, once it's in a lifetime over. aspect. I was at Rats. that game. This shit, fucking. <laughs> Who shows at that game? Though. All right, we're getting into the trades. N- nothing else about LeBron. Congrats, LeBron. Shout out to oh, the all-time yeah, leading scorer, top two at I least have minimum. All right, these trades. <laughs> trade deadline went crazy. Now let's get into this. All right, let's start with the Kyrie trade because that happened a crazy. few days uh, before the trade deadline. Read it out, Mavericks get Kyrie Irving. He actually already played his first game with them. Uh, Nets get Spencer Dinwiddie, Dorian Finney-Smith, first round pick, and multiple second round picks. 2029, right? Yeah, 2029, unprotected, first round pick. How do we feel about this trade for both teams? Start with the Nets. Just start with the Nets. Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't know. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't like what they got. I mean, it don't make sense. Yeah, because... they didn't get like hot shit for him. I feel like they could have got better shit for him. It's because now that you see the KD trade, which we'll talk about, like. The other packages they were getting, first of all, the Suns trading, offering them Chris Paul Dang for this man. shit, and then they trade for KD is just uh, funny as fuck. It doesn't fit with the direction that they're going if they want to get Chris Paul too, though. But no, I'm saying that's just funny. They also, I'm not even saying that. But then the Lakers trade makes more sense because the Lakers giving you the two, both the unprotected picks, and they were gonna throw in Christie or Reeves or one of them. So you know he has a vendetta with them though. What? Uh, Josiah. He wasn't going to do it. Yeah, that's the, the thing. That's the thing. But he was, just, he was just being spiteful. But <laughs> He's a D1 man, hater, bro. He's just a D1 hater. Still, it makes you think, like, why would they try to get back those specific players? Because, like, Dorian Finney, Smith, Spencer, Dinwiddie, they're, like, in the prime. Like, they're not yeah. players you build with. So, it's just interesting. You know I, think? I, I think they're trying to build, like, a all-God defensive team or something like that. Because they got a top-notch defensive team right now with all the players that they have. But they don't really have a go-to guy. And don't fucking say Cam Thomas. Dinwiddie. Cam Thomas is a bucket. Oh, nice, man. He's not a scorer, though. He scored like... He, scored like he has like, tunnel he's, vision he's scored 20 bad, points, like, He has tunnel vision bad. He, he doesn't know how to handle like double teams. Five, he needs to get better at that shit. His arm's too long to, like, do anything, like, serious. Yeah, they can be scoring A's, hey, like, his last five years. Oh, what about for the Mavs, though? For the Mavs. Will you like it Yeah, I like it for the Mavs. But, honestly, for the Nets, I think they made the right decision getting what they got for Kyrie. Because you got to remember he's on a one-year... His history with him maybe leaving the team that he doesn't want to be on. And then other teams might not want to extend him. Say if the Bulls went for Kyrie and traded like Levine or something like that. 
that aspect for them because Kyrie can just leave and then you leave lose the game for nothing. Plus, I mean, of course, Rounder is old in this league and for Kyrie Irving. So I guess they, they did the right thing or they got as much as they could with what they were handled. At the time, like, assuming they were trying to keep KD, it made sense to the players they got back. So, and it was a good package for the situation. You know, Kyrie, it's just last year, the deal, you know, he comes with his, like, baggage and whatnot. So, it, you know, it was a good package for that situation, considering all those factors. Um, for the Nets, though, or sorry, for the Mavericks, I think that they did, they, they played it perfectly because Spencer Dinwiddie and Dorian Finney-Smith aren't going to lead you anywhere in the Western they're Conference. Nice. They're not nice. Yeah. And like you got to decide if or you got to know if Luke can play with another superstar, and this is like a one year sample of oh, is he good with certain players? Can he play with certain players? Right. Change up his play style, and you, you literally you only lost the first round pick like twenty twenty nine. If Luke is, Luke is still going to be contracted there, right? That pick is washed. Like, well, yeah, they, you don't if have they to resign him for pick. sure. Yeah, yeah, if he extends, yeah, you don't have to. You don't really have to care for that pick, so you you're going to send it away regardless, either now or in the future. So like. Having a Kyrie sample for one year, if he walks away, okay, you know you've gotten information about what Luca needs to be True. successful. That's a good point. Yeah, and you can uh, possibly get to the Western Conference Finals with him. Yeah. And then if you keep Kyrie, you keep Kyrie. How good many games have they played with? One. One. Yeah, one win? without Luca. Luca didn't play. Yeah, Luca didn't play. They expected to play Friday or Saturday, right? If I'll say this. He's gonna play one of them. They beat the Clippers. Oh, they beat them. They beat the Clippers. Yeah, Kyrie. Yeah. Let me let me like say 20. this about the Mavs because they didn't make any other trades, so they're gonna be good with the buyout market. If if they could get some guys from that, that'll help a lot. We'll talk about some of the dudes that like getting bought out and whatnot from some of these trades. Um, so if they could get some guys with that, that'll help them. I like them giving Josh Green more minutes because I like how he plays. Um, they're gonna give Tim Hardaway. I don't really like that contract, but you could trade him too in the off season. Um, and this is good. This. Kyrie's a clear upgrade over Spencer Dinwiddie. The Dorian Finney-Smith, like Maxi Cleaver comes back, he fills that same role, so you're kind of fine. Yeah, they lose still, defensively, it's still, it's a, yeah, I say, yeah, it's like, it's, it's one more wing defender for sure. That's why I'm hoping, like, but it's like they already market. they already weren't that good defensively. Yeah, like, that's, once they got better was, offensively. Yeah, for sure. But yeah, once playoff but comes, you're going to have to score like Kyrie, and they're going to have to do the 40-40. Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Once playoff comes and they isolate Luka, you can also isolate Kyrie too. So like, you can't double him. You can't double Christian Wood needs to step up. And then Christian Wood could be in. I mean, he, he needs a good shot blocker, though. He's not really good defensively. Yeah, he's not. He's not. He can bully he's too. Step up the yes. Yeah, like I was hoping. Yeah, like hopefully, they can do something. Whoever's bought. I don't it's know. a good move for them, though. This I is think. all the mindset before the KD trade. <laughs> this is what that I'm is thinking before too. the KD trade. But it's just like, oh, bro, that OG shit, dude, I was crying. Bro, they really was like, he he, he must be the KD stopper. Like, <laughs> they were like, oh, like, the, 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 the picks, the, the stakes are getting higher on yeah, They OG must have asked for something crazy. Yeah, they didn't even trade him. I don't blame like, them, though. They're trying to they milk it. Like, they, they, they for yeah, sure like, trying to milk it. And if they didn't think they could get, like, I know Masai Ujiri to do, like, the Toronto's GM. If he can't finesse you, probably not trading with you. Like, I'm not even going to lie. <laughs> <laughs> That's how he operates. So yeah. Honestly. Unless he wants to get his dues. Like, <laughs> they traded for Yaka. We'll tr talk about that. Yeah. But what that's, 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 that's how niggas in fantasy. What do you think about the trade game? <laughs> that's Kyrie, true. Kyrie next. <laughs> I, before the trade even happened, I said either I expected Kyrie to go to LA, Lakers, or the Mavs. He ended up going to the Mavs. I did think, I do think the Mavs won in the sense that, yeah, like, Luka and Kyrie. It's hard to judge that now. It's too early. It's hard to judge, but, like, in essence, like, when you're playing, when you're go when you have to verse the Mavs, you essentially cannot double either of them because they're both doubleable players. Yeah. So if you do decide to double, and then you, the other one gets, and you decide to double, it's very hard as a defense to react to two very, very like, yeah, like people can score at will. Honestly, like it's just very hard. It's gonna be hard to compete against. Off ball too. Yeah, he can play off ball too. He's he's done it. He's done it with like Braun. And so let's. That thing about this trade though is like I think Kevin Durant's a better fit for Kyrie Irving the, for play style rather than Luca. So like did the that's did they I mean they had to trade him but yeah it really fell off a cliff with what they did. Uh, if Kyrie's we, happy, we'll talk I'm about happy. the Nets later after the the last trade because the, the, yeah. the we get they Kyrie yeah, probably feels right, so validated. <laughs> Nets fans, this is if a Kyrie's safe happy, space. I'm happy. Where's Simmons yeah. at? He did the right thing. He, he waited till the last week, said, get uh, me out of here. He, you guys fucked up. You guys tried to make me do all this bullshit demands. Now I want out. Get rid of me. So they had to get rid of him. Now he's on the Mavs. I'm happy. Self-inflicted wounds, though. There's going to be 30 for 30 on this. Why would you want to Why would you want to stay to a, a, a city that like doesn't even want you there? Of course he you want to leave. He lost three Hall of Famers in the span of one year. <laughs> he anyway, did a lot of teams, he did, but he's, he's probably salty as hell. He's like, God damn. We're going to talk about that trade because we'll, we'll, we'll spend a lot of time on w. that. W. Kyrie. Let's get to the next one, which I thought was good. 
Uh, when it happened, it's the Lakers trade. That was <laughs> good. <laughs> what do you mean? It's the good. Yeah, like, I thought it was a, 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 a yeah, finesse. No. And which one? Which one? Lakers. Let me read this. Let me read this. <laughs> Lakers get up. D'Angelo Russell, Jared Vanderbilt, Malik Beasley. Jazz get Russ, who gets bought out. Juan T, Damian Jones, doesn't matter. First round pick, top four protected. Wolves get Mike Conley, Nikhil Alexander-Walker, two second round picks. Who want to start on this trade? Any, any, I, I'm the Laker fan. Lakers I below, Lakers below. Lakers W. It's a Laker W. Right, a great trade. Needed a point guard. We got one. All right. So, shooters. I, I, I've been thinking about this. So, this is what I'll say. I like this because it turns us from a team that we, we were talking about at the beginning of the year. Our core was who? It was obviously LeBron and AD. And it's like Austin Reeves and Max Christie. Yeah. Now we actually bring in guys who are young. We can re sign these dudes and actually have some continuity. Like, yeah. now replace oh, the God, roster bro, every year. Like, like, yeah. We got to stop year. trying to do this shit with the. Okay, we'll sign three superstars and fill the rest with minimum players. Like, it don't work like that. You have to build these guys up. The only reason the Warriors got those type of max players is because they developed those max yeah, players. So they were able to sign, like, other players that were good. And so if the Lakers, yes, they can bring guys in, but they also need to, to place uh, players around those guys that fit. We get more shooting with Malik. We get more shooting with D'Lo. Vanderbilt fills defensive role. And now you, bring, you keep these guys. You develop them. What would you say? <laughs> what did anyway, he say? I you, got defense, you got you got on the you got oh, on the big tape, D, big D, you? big D, big oh, D. Oh, big D. And you keep these guys. You develop continuity. You can if if all. By the way, D'Angelo is expiring. So if Kyrie say fuck it, I still want to come to LA. You could let him go. You could let Malik Beasley you go and sign the max. Huh? Afford him with the max. There's a way to finesse it. You can also there's a, a trade thing for Mo Bamba. You could trade him away and not pay him. Uh -oh. So his contract. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, we'll talk about his little thing later. Um, Let me talk Jack about uh, Minnesota. I don't know what this organization is doing. <laughs> they basically just got Mike Conley. Let me say this. Let me say this. Let me say this real quick. Mike Conley. It, 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 I agree with you, but their only hope, like their only way they're like, the reason they think this will work is because he played with Rudy already. <laughs> So he knows like how to play with Rudy. Now l l let me finish this. He knows how to play with Rudy. They're, that that that's their only thing they can be clinging to. Because D'Lo hates playing with Rudy. He don't pass him the fucking ball. <laughs> Conley at least is that veteran guy. Like he's not gonna. Yeah, he not D'Lo where he can't go off for like thirty a night randomly. But he also is not gonna chuck a bad shot. Still good. Like, that's what still I'm saying. Let, let, let me explain. Is he? Yeah. He's still, he's still decent. Like, solid, solid, solid. I mean, he's he's getting old. He's like, he's but he still played decent, yeah, bro. He's like, like he's he's not gonna good, take yeah, like, two stupid ass downgrade. shots like Dino. He's a good he's veteran point guard to have. He's, like, he's, 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 I know it's a down, but that's what I'm saying. You hope like maybe play, play wise, play, he doesn't like, take bad shots and do stupid turnovers. He has other positives. He has other positives. Subtraction. You know what I mean? Like Anthony Edwards on the on the freaking roster. He's not passing it to Gobert. All right. Yeah, Conley will though. Conley will though. He's gonna pass it more than Dilo. At the end of the day, Conley's still like a real point guard. Like he's 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 more pass first than Dilo. To be honest, got better. No, but it's, no, I'm well, saying fit, it's not a like, completely terrible move yeah, for them. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, it's, it's just the fact that that's all they got. <laughs> like, in like are they keeping yeah, Nikhil? Yeah, are they like, going to keep Nikhil? But yeah, like, yeah, yeah. But he's ass. He's he's yeah, nah, he's, 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 he's young. young. He's young. He's, he's young. young. He's, he's a volume scorer. Watch. Utah did did their thing though, man. Utah did their thing. Got another first round pick. I think that 15 within like the next three years. They could have got more. To be honest, Utah they traded away Conley, Vando, and. Um, Malik got go one of, protected uh, first round pick yeah, but for you get it. a Westbrook's contract and you buy him out halfway through That is season, good for them. We got go, cap yeah. space they can let these guys develop, so it's not a complete L. But I thought, like, they were saying before the season started, we want a first round pick for each of these guys. They got <laughs> one protected <laughs> yeah. one for, the, for all you of gotta, them. You got to blow up, right? Because at the end of the day, like, when after you're going to do that Rudy? many Rudy? picks at the end of the day, like, you, yeah. you, there's only so many they don't need you have on They don't need the assets, though. Trade value. It's good trade value. Good assets. I know, but like, they probably is, aren't, um, aren't pressed to like, oh, I need, you know, I need to have a, a one for each of them, you know, yeah. like. Also, the funny thing is that uh, like, Utah did what well, OKC did in half a year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, oh, God, bro. They took them niggas like eight years. Like, <laughs> they got a better record two already. Picks. And, and they've been, they've already talent. started using them, though. They like. got all-stars this year, first time. But, yo, that is so crazy. It took them like so fucking long. that dude's name from the Celtics that went to Utah? I think they're Kelly Olenek. Oh, no. or, or Danny Ainge. Oh, Danny Ainge, yes. Man's working. I'm surprised he did this. He, he should be trying to finesse Ainge more nice too. He better finesse in with that Nets uh, Celtics yeah, This trade. is like the first trade uh, he crazy. ain't finesse, like straight up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm surprised he did it. Yeah. What do you guys rate these out of 10 of each team? What okay. would you rate the Lakers? Okay. Lakers. Okay. Lakers and, yeah. Great. Give me a grade. Okay, we'll start We'll start in order. Give give one for the Lakers first, then we'll do Timberwolves and Utah. Go in order. Wait, is it number or letter? Letter, letter. Go ahead. I'll go first. Lakers. B plus. 
Oh, really? There's yeah. pluses and minuses? Yeah. Yeah, you can't just you know what I'm saying? Lakers it. great. A minus. I'm going to give it a B plus too, dude. Excuse me. I'm a, I'm a... <laughs> I was just thinking about this shit. I'm so sorry. I was thinking about this fucking. I'm gonna give it. I'm gonna give it a minus as well. I had to say. All right. I think because it's like it's damn near perfect though. Like yeah. They, they like perfectly. We had like like like, like this. We had these issues. The only thing I would I would get a plus if we would have got like better center. If our pick was more protected, like, like yeah, Chandler, lottery, I would have say like, like, like if the lottery away, protected Thomas Bryant, but like I mean Jared Vanderbilt's better than Mo we're Bronco, just talking right? about this trade. We're not that's talking about a Thomas Bryant yeah, show. Yeah, I'm talking no, about this trade. I'm saying like uh, this trade, like they needed a point guard. They got one. They needed shooting. They got two people who could shoot, both above forty percent, and they needed some defense, some wing defense, and they got them. They got young, yeah, young kids. Yeah, they got like and so it's just like we had. It's like if they had a checklist of shit that we needed, they went down the checklist and went like it that. It definitely makes you a better team. I mean? like, yeah. it, that's why just like, that. that's yeah. what I'm gonna say. Like, because there's other people they could have tried to go get and stuff, but they may not have fit the same way that these play. Like, I think they got the best of what they could besides like, yeah. Kyrie. You know, Honestly, like, like no, nah, I don't know. Really I was gonna say I'd rather have this, but I rather. Would have you rather Kyrie. have Kyrie than these guys? I'd rather have Kyrie. Oh, sure. I'd rather have oh, Kyrie. Oh yeah, yeah, of yeah. course. When it matters most. He's going if, we got, like, if we got like, if we got like old Lynn and some other that would be like maybe to be in the play. Day, like, <laughs> at the end of the day, a superstar trade is like you know it's it's straightforward. You, you get a superstar. Like I think for the Lakers, to, they need to, to stop like, trying to superstar. Like they yeah, need to chill out. I like this. I'm saying I like I like this a lot. 2020 when it's Braun, AD, and role and then good role players. You know, get a superstar. Your OD like yes, but it's win. But still, like the right these, they're flexible though. Rob did a good job because again, yeah, a right. lot of these guys you can like find ways to trade them or opt them out, or some of them straight up Delos free agent. Malik is a team option. You so. want to uh, replicate the what depth. the Warriors did with their super team? Like if you can get it's those like, type of players or those type of personalities on one team, the league's done. You know? Yeah. But it's like our depth. Like before, it was like superstars and then just ass, and now we have like it pushed the ass down. And now we got to clip that. Put the ass down. You know what I mean? Like. Now is, here, now is the superstar, good role players, and then the <laughs> bum niggas. Like, you know, yeah, as like. Know. All right, let's grade the Minnesota. All right, Minnesota, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead. You go, Mark. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Minnesota. Like, you know, we gotta think about this one, right? I'll say like. Yeah. <laughs> like, like a D. I'll give him a. I'll give him a C. I was gonna C minus here. I mean, Mike Conley, Mike it's just Mike Conley, like... No, I mean, Mike Conley's good, but it's like, that's Again, all they got. The only say I, a reason I say C is he won't do the stupid shit yeah. that D-Lo does. And that, that might be enough yeah, to, like, win or something. Your point. Yeah, that you. offsets d like, yeah. I'm not saying it's going to happen, but, like, that, I'm saying that's their only I'm, clinging I'm, all, I'm, all, I'm thinking about the what they gave up for Rudy Gobert, too, and, like, okay, wait, they're saying, like, Rudy's our centerpiece type of thing. Him if and they Anthony got Gobert's this pick, towns. it would be a lot higher. If they got the yeah, first yeah. round pick, they got second round picks. Second round picks are like second pills these go, days. Second round pick goes like, around yo, though. I'm like, where did these shit get so valuable? <laughs> we gonna like, fucking talk about some like, second damn. round picks. Right, Who the fuck gonna <laughs> draft these motherfuckers? <laughs> I'm like, yo, like, how many second rounds are like, there? I'm going like this. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna sit here and think, I'm like, is it just me? Like, they, they always trade these fucking second round picks like this? Like, nah, nah, Rudy, changed like, the, Rudy changed the game, bro. These oh, picks are on crack now, man. Yeah, dude. They're ruin the league again. For the Utah? Let's break Utah. Let's break Utah now. Uh, for Utah now. C plus. I got, what if I got an A for Utah? A's high, but I got a B. I got a yeah, solid B. Who do you talk? <laughs> got a B. Westbrook. And oh, they're gonna. Bar. They got Westbrook. They bought him yeah, out. Yeah. Oh, they're gonna buy him out. I forgot to got protect it. I forgot to protect yeah. it. Top four. So make it an A minus. B plus. B plus. Okay. Yeah, I was like, bro, that's <laughs> high as hell compared to what I was thinking yeah, of. I'll give it a C plus. I'll give it a B just because they could. I mean, they yeah, probably could have like tried to get a couple, or, like or at least like no, some seconds. I think they did. If they got some seconds, I just think them lose. Him, the Vanderbilt was on that team, right? They don't care about him. He's gonna yeah, but he's a good young. He's a good young guy. I don't know. I, I like him. They want to play Obagi. They want to play Kessler. They Kessler's play sick. Laurie, Kessler's good. So. You're right. For them, yeah, they didn't matter. First, I guess that much. The first round pick is a dub for them and cap space. That's they got what they needed to do. They give guys more minutes too. Like they got yeah. Baji playing now. Sexton's gonna play more. They got a good uh, culture building <laughs> up Sexton. Oh yeah, Sexton since Colony's gone, so Sexton's gonna have to step up even more. He's I love that. Because he's gonna play more. He's <laughs> like, developed at least some. He says Sexton's ass. Injury, THC finna play more. <laughs> I forgot about that. Dude. THC got. I saw a picture of THC. Like he looked way fatter after he left the Lakers. That shit was hilarious. Yeah, on the, the <laughs> amount of hype THC got on the Lakers. They wanted us to trade Lowry for him. I rather have THC though. No, he was hyped. He had a three. I, I, he had a three game god span, and then I remember LeBron's like, "Oh, this is the greatest." <laughs> and, then, and then he fell off so the bad. The GM. <laughs> He's like, "This is the greatest twenty year old ever." Yada yada. Or, All right. Uh, in the in the world, yeah. something like that. Ooh. 
Uh, Next pick. We oh, are oh, yeah. not even a KD trade 30 Wait, minutes in, so let's get through this one. Small little trade happened. I'm going in order, by the yeah, way, when it happened. Uh, Josh Hart, you see that, to the New York Knicks for Cam Reddish and a protected first round pick. Lottery protect. Yep. Let me say this about the Blazers. Overall, in the trade deadline, they took a fat L. We're going to talk about some other trades they made. But, yeah, I don't know what they're doing, man. I mean, I know Josh Hart didn't want to be there, and you trade him. But you give him mm. to Jalen Brunson, and mm. they, they reunited in the Villanova boys. Mm. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Dame, what run. Run Reddish from the grind, bro. Please. <laughs> what is Cam Reddish even going to do for the roster? Like, they Josh Hart's a better grinding. addition. That's stop really grinding. Worse. You need three and D wings. You got less Take three and D. Like, out. what you doing? I, Dude, I guarantee Cam Reddish is not going to play. Uh, he's going to get DMPs by the end of the year. Bro, Dame, Dame has never heard. I just see a starter caliber player on their roster. Bro, I'm playing Keon Johnson over Cam Reddish. I think. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Like, I think he's probably better player right now. Dame, right. Dame, be arguing against team. work smarter, not harder. He's like, nah, nigga, I want to work harder. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, I, I respect it. Next, there was a W next nah, trade though. This I is think is insane. Good for Josh, the Josh, Josh Hart's a W player. Oh, he's kicking my fucking player. Grimes right out that starting they line. Might as well, they might as well so? just like got a back. Josh Hart's like, a W. Uh, he, he's he's the typical yeah, typical Thibodeau player oh, defender. Sure. Does all little stuff. I know Tim is gonna love him. Yeah. Like burn him to the bone. He's gonna he's gonna play in like forty five minutes. I actually think he will. He's gonna get like two points, two rebounds. I, I mean, you can't fire him. He's doing what they're supposed yeah, to do. Yeah, I know. They're playing well. They're playing yeah. well. Brunson's having a great season. He gets to play with his college teammate. That'll be fun. Yeah, so they already have chemistry on the court. And then Josh Hart can, I think, plug in and play in any offense. Mm -hmm. Especially nice. Thibodeau's, though. So yeah, nice. great role like, That's why I like Josh Hart. Josh Hart fits everywhere. I love He's it. All time. Good. A w for New York. W for New York. Let's, let's, grade, let's grade it real quick. Yeah. You want, I'll go. Let's throw in Knicks. Quick grades. Quick I'll grades. go first. I'll go first. B, B plus. Yeah, B plus. B. I'll give it a B plus. Nice. Uh, for the Trailblazers? Yeah. Uh, like D minus F. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, D. Cam Reddish is like not who they want. I don't know what was going on. I, I mean, no. I'll give them a D minus because they got a first round. Yeah. Right. Well, they D, got a first D. round of it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. D minus. D plus. I said D, D minus. Plus. Protected. D plus. I mean, any first round is good, honestly. F plus. The Knicks. <laughs> fucking plus. Oh, no. This they is got, this year. Like no, this is this year. So, yeah. The Knicks are going to be. Oh, my God. They got Svi. Yeah. That guy used to be a Laker. Svi? Svi. I think got rerouted to the Hornets. All right. Here later. <laughs> he might have, but there was so much going right. on today. Next trade, next trade. Kevin Nash got rerouted somewhere. The <laughs> fuck the demo. Know, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Doc, no, we won't. <laughs> Actually, we he's will. A, he's in the worst part of yeah. yeah. So, this is the Raptors trade. Um, Raptors get Jacopoto back. Spurs get Kem Birch. Protected 2024 first round pick. Two second round picks. How are we feeling about this one? I want to go take I don't a step. I know these boys are. I think yeah. You I, I don't. You, 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 you can sit this one out. We can, you don't have some of these guys. You good, bro? Who are these niggas? Who are these people? All right. Who want to give their Who want to give their thoughts though? I, I don't know what Toronto is doing. Yeah. Going into this, we thought that OG was gonna get traded. Pascal was gonna get, or Pascal maybe was gonna get traded. They're gonna try to build it around Scotty. Jakob's like what, twenty nine or something like. Everybody was close to getting traded. No, yeah, yeah he's, Toronto was like favored. Like they were like the number one team. People I heard, thought uh, Raptors their players were on the block, bro. Yeah, all of them. Ben Fleet, except Barnes, Barnes, except Scotty Barnes, yeah, everybody. Them. Gary Trent, see all, all these guys are up. But I don't know what they were thinking today, they're bro. Giving up assets with it with a pick and then two second round picks. So I don't know what they're doing. I'll say there. this: if the, if there was no first round pick, I'll say it's good. But yeah. you're giving him next year's because you could realistically be ass next year, bro. Mm -hmm. You're yeah. giving him a 2024 first round pick. I don't know how protected first it is. How, is it, how how protected it is? It, it doesn't say specifically, but um, it doesn't say on my mind here either. Fight. But still, like you're giving him a first round pick when I think Gary Trent yeah, could hard. bounce. Uh, Fred Van Vliet oh, they're blowing that up. They're blowing that whole up in the offseason. That's what I'm saying. They didn't get any anybody for them. OG, you can keep. Pascal no, is fine. He's the is you'll so, get a lot like, of assets. That is so crazy. crazy. No, you, you should have traded him, but I'm saying like he's under contract, so you could still trade him later and get something back for him. You lose value because he's already gone another year. Like, that, that, I don't I'm understand. Saying, I, I'm saying you're right, but still, like they, they could get something back for him. But, but with this trade, like they're going to re-sign Jakob. Give up a first round pick, but like I get they need center play, sure. But it's like it's not now, worth then? the first round and two seconds. I guess they're trying to win now. Uh, that's what they're saying with this trade. The East got easier, didn't it? Yeah, <laughs> uh, that's for sure. So I mean, only lost the Nets, only lost that. That's, uh, that's actually yeah. crazy that these niggas left the East. Like, uh, back I'm out. <laughs> they it out to the West. Was getting Why would the Brooklyn send them to their own conference? Like, of course, they <laughs> wouldn't do that. Yeah, yeah they just like, have a chance to compete. San Antonio did their thing though. They got another, they got a pick that they need. It's a good pick for them. Yeah. Very good pick. Very good pick. Yeah, and like. They're already. Trash, they're they so. not even trying to be good. So yeah, yeah, but I say like they they're they just don't, chilling. They're okay, like right. they're like y'all did not. Grades, grades, grades. Uh, I didn't mean to interrupt. No, I was, I was saying grades too. Okay. Um, 
What is start with the Raptors? What is it until you get? Uh, first round pick, two second round picks, and, picks a, and a salary filler. Toronto, I'll give like a C. I don't, I don't. It was not too bad, but I mean, Pirtle's still not not horrible. So based on what you didn't know what they're they're trying to do, dude. I don't know. Just, what just trade in a vacuum. You just gotta look at yeah, it. Yeah, for this trade, it's like a, overall Toronto. I'm giving them lower grades, but this one's like yeah, a C. It's yeah. not horrible. Right, it's not amazing. Yeah. So I'm in the middle. I agree with you. I'll give them a C. I'll give them a C plus for just because they also needed center play. So it's like it feels somewhat of a need, That's but the first round's too much. I think. C minus. Cause I don't know who the fuck the. That's good. Yeah, That's good. Go. That's and, and give a C. If back, you don't know, just give yeah. C's. We'll understand. They give away two second round picks too. Now yeah, that yeah, now that I know they're pumping them like pills, I'm like, no, these second picks are valuable now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What'd you give them? What'd you give Raptors? All right. What about what about uh quick San Antonio? Uh, um, I gave them a B plus. B. Yeah, that's they a, what they need to do. Yeah, B plus. B plus. B. Damn near A minus. Cool, cool. Damn near A minus. I don't know about the A minus. Right, we got the big one right here. This is what we've all been waiting for. The big drop. <laughs> hey, this right, boom. <laughs> fucking what? One a.m. on the East Coast. Uh, people be waking up. Their teams blown up. I was crying. I was uh, crying. Brooklyn Nets fans getting up <laughs> for work suck. and seeing that they lost <laughs> KD. That does suck for them. Imagine you getting up for work, making your coffee. Oh my god. <laughs> so the trade is the trade is let me read all the details here the suns get kevin durant and tj warren the nets get mikhail bridges cam johnson jay crowder or unprotected first round pick and a 2028 first round pick swap we the valley where's my jersey the kevin durant jersey oh my in. god the dick all rider the elite is here <laughs> I need that Phoenix jersey watching every Phoenix game. That's <laughs> crazy. Yeah, man. My man's got <laughs> I've been dire since they won. <laughs> Shameless. I've, I've Shameless. I've been here since the Charles yeah. Barkley days. Shameless. <laughs> Charles Barkley. They got four first rounders? Yeah. Oh, five, yeah technically. One, what one's a the, the fuck? <laughs> I, mean, I was watching the 60s. Durant. It's Kevin Durant, though. It's Kevin Durant, bro. You know who I am. <laughs> I'm Kevin Durant. You know who I am. Wasn't TJ Warren doing good for a little bit, too? And the oh, bubble, he averaged like 40. He's, he's, but it's, he got, he's a body that Phoenix needs. Yeah. Need a uh, single takes on these. You want to start game? Or... Yeah, we, we need we need to take our <laughs> turn. Just give your take on the Suns straight up. On the Suns, just say say whatever you got to say. If I'm the Suns, it's absolutely ten out of ten, eleven out of ten times I'm doing this trade. I'm pulling the trigger easily. If you're getting KD, that you're getting KD. You give up Mikel, you give up Cam, and you move on. You're getting KD, bro. That's simple as that. That's all I can say. And TJ Warren. And TJ Warren, but KD. Give me right. take, Hus. Give me take. Kevin Durant is the best basketball player in the world. <laughs> <laughs> My man got a whole speech right now for that. You heard that? He He's said, that was, chill out, chill out, chill, chill out. I need your take on the team, not, not his career Durant, legacy. Kevin Durant He's is the best anything. player in the world. <laughs> Hudson, that's crazy. Oh, hey, Hudson's too handy, it's crazy. Oh, let me cook, let me cook. How do your knees feel right now? God let damn. Let, let, let him, them shit's skinned. Yeah, cook, dude. If you put him in the right, if you put him in the right basketball position to maximize his his production, He's easily the best basketball player in the world. I saw him with Stephen Curry and Clay Thompson. You put him with Devin Booker and the leadership of Chris Paul. This man is, is going to take over the league. We're going to be talking about him as the best player in, in the world. Once the playoffs come and they're healthy. Oh, this. Oh, oh, oh. I saw them. 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 Where was Can that shit? Can we have a non-dick take? Can we have a non-dick We also take? we also saw Andrew Wiggins with <laughs> Steph Curry. Where was that shit in OKC? It was not what Kevin Durant did. Who was that shit? It was not what Kevin Durant did on the Warriors. Right? Let, 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 let's take turns. Let me give him my non-dick rider take, and you could go next. You go, could go, go next. Go, go, go. You go next. First of all, I'm not even gonna respond to the ridiculous shit he just said. That shit was not objective at all. That shit was just dick riding KD. He that said nothing about the trade. Let me let me talk about this first of all. I agree with Gabe on this. If that's KD, you do to take this package. They got to keep Aiden on top of this. And the reason they got to keep Aiden was because Ben Simmons on the team. About Aiden too, man. The reason they got to keep Aiden. So that's double L. You got to keep Aiden yeah. because Ben Simmons on the team and you can't have the two rookie max extensions from the same team on the same roster. It's a, it's a rule. I forgot Ooh, poison pill or something. Yeah, yeah. And so Nick Claxton too. I don't think he's on a max though. No, no, I'm saying you can't get Aiden when you have Claxton. Yeah, I guess too, but just you couldn't even trade for him like in in it oh, if so you, you wanted. He to. can't trade for his. Like he legally cannot have, have his contract because they crazy. have Ben Simmons, it's crazy. Yeah. which is cool. fucking te- atrocious. I'm sorry, Brooklyn. Ben Simmons, Brooklyn. He could have done it extension? during the off season though, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, but he's he's still, he already signed with the same team. Yeah. So, but yeah, 
sucks for them. But yeah, they they got to keep those, and they got back TJ Warren, who obviously is not Man. no bubble TJ Warren, but he's a rotational player yeah, at yeah, least. Yeah, yeah, he's a body yeah, that'll come player. in. I don't sure, know if he'll I mean, start. Player, I don't think yeah. he should start. He, I don't think no. he should be playing over twenty five minutes a game anyway. Um, but yeah, Nets. A complete utter disaster organization. We need a thirty for thirty <laughs> on how terrible this yeah. shit is. That was a fumble. Um, just big fumble. Like you, you had three Hall of Famers and they all requested a trade. All three of them. All three of them motherfuckers said we don't want to be here because you guys run shit like clowns or whatever weird. the case is. Pissed all three of them off. Run all requested weird. a trade. They got a total of ten games together and won one playoff series. So. <laughs> I mean, saying that is just ridiculous because you look at their careers individually, all top tier Hall of Famers. Be the greatest ballot. offensive uh, lineup ever. The, the worst ass. super team. Uh, it should have been. Yeah, Complete like, fumble uh, on the Nets part. Best and lineup great. to ever be that ass. Like. They're, they're going to come out with more details. Kyrie already talking, saying, like, I'm glad he got out of there and shit. So, man, it's going to be insane. But for the Suns, now I'm looking at from an objective perspective for the Suns, <laughs> they easily the favorites to win the championship. We don't, we don't have to speculate that. But the... the Okay, the thing with the Suns is important things going for the Suns forward is health, one hundred percent. When he does gets injured, they're done for. Like it's no question. Yeah. It's, it's a wrap. So. I really no, besides, don't. Depends besides, on who it is. I don't yeah. think so. Yeah. goes down. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. 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 KD yeah. goes down, they have oh, yeah. zero. Yeah, yeah. If, Booker if, KD. If, if Booker goes down, down though. It's, it's, it's fine. CP goes down. Small chance, and I'll say this: they need to they need to focus on his bio market because there's some names here that that are going to be big. Because the rest of the rotation, as of right now, is trash. They have Tory Craig, well, I mean, T.J. Warren, and Campaign. Like that's not enough for uh, in the oh, playoffs, playoffs. It is nice. eight man rotation. I don't think you Start can be playing A-man. Campaign consistently. Oh, out for CP's minutes though. Good, good you want a better player like Reggie Jackson is a bio guy. I think they should yeah. look in to get. Yeah, they should uh, look to get. Awesome. Will Barton got bought out. They yeah. should look to get a guy like. How him. do buyouts work? Like if when they it's get bought out, they pay their contract and they're gone. It's only one year deals. You don't want to be at the team anymore. Obviously, you don't have to. Contractually obliged yeah, yeah, yeah. the one year you sign with a different. They team. can go with whoever they want though. Yeah, well, yeah, they're they mutually good. agree part ways. Basically, thing I'll yeah, say about giving the money. Uh, uh, after after go with KD if you want. He's not going. I don't think he will do that. Oh. That would be crazy. If Russ goes to the Suns, because he's getting no. bought out. I think I think he's gonna go to the Clippers, bro. Paul like, George. Didn't the Clippers or the Bulls want him or something? The Clippers gonna get him. Okay. I said, what was that trade last night when we were like, then we would like kill himself. If like when we thought somebody like oh, I said Aiden for Plumley and Rozier. <laughs> yeah, they said it away. Wow, yeah, Aiden yeah, yeah, for Rozier, dude. It was Devin Plumley was and Rozier. I said that. I said that. Like, yeah. like, yeah. They had me crying. Hey, Lamelo and Aiden though. <laughs> anyway, no, um, uh, yeah, I want to say this though for campaign, he's good off the bench because what we saw with his playoff run when CP was uh, when they made it to the finals. He was but last year he was fucking awful. Or the whole team. So, was well. I guess so. But did, did they give their opinions on? Did they give their takes? No, let me finish. your bench, yeah. Yeah, let me wrap it. We start talking about uh, fucking making fun of the trade. Uh, yeah, so the Suns, Biomark is going to be important. They should be the favorite. I don't see really a team. Like I said, the Nuggets, if they made a move for like OG, that's the only team I saw that could have messed with them, but they didn't do anything like that. Um, you know who I am. <laughs> again, it, health oh, is going to be big. Health is going to be big. And if somehow they don't win this fucking t- title in the next two years, is Chris Paul's the biggest, like, it's got to be someone. CP zero I'll, rings. I'll, I'll tattoo on my phone. Yeah, you got to deal I'm with that. You got to <laughs> deal with CP I'm winning a ring. On his head. I mean, I like Kevin Durant and Devin Booker enough for them to win a ring. And CP's the little tag along guy who gets his ring. <laughs> yeah, but, but he's, like, like, they lose, he's not I, averaging over 10 CP's points head. ever again. He's never averaging over ten points in his career. He got career. a little like spurts yeah. where he'll score like six. He can score in a game, but he's averaging he nine, average nine 12, points bro. a game. I think he averages like twelve. No, no. How many assists? How many assists do you think you're like? Like thirteen a game. <laughs> nine and thirteen. Is have the a, stat nash, line. a nash line. I think so. Line. Bro, what? What? KD. You'd rather have the ball. KD. You'd rather give the ball to Booker. Like, and you gotta give Aiden his touches. KD's still good though. The thing with KD makes him like. One of the greats is because he's super efficient. and doesn't shoot a lot or doesn't demand the ball. Well, you want him to shoot a lot. He never does though. Yeah, he doesn't shoot that. That's what I was saying. Right. He can come in just with 15 bucket. shots a game and like dropping 20. Oh, for sure. 100%. For sure. Yeah, give or take, I'll take it before, yeah, before you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, bro, going if you're so good, bro, what happened to OKC? Why you, why you be praising them? They so made it to the, the finals. Don't blame that shit on Westbrook. Game, 100%. game six, What's Clay happened. Um, There's a bunch of stuff that happened. Yeah, game six, Clay, too. Westbrook's a main factor. Westbrook was balling, though. Pardon? And with KD, for this team, they're going to ask him, or more like that's going to be his role primarily because you think so Devin be Booker's still there Devin yeah, Booker yeah. still can give you 30 no him and not anymore going to be the two scores it's going to yeah. be similar to no, Luka and Kyrie you, you but gotta, now they have Chris Chris Paul he has to handle the ball to distribute it because that's the that's his main strength at this point yes. and and he has to be the distributor so he's going to get KD open shots because they're going to double block yeah, off screens etc etc he's one of the best ever doing it into a in the post 
Durant's uh, gameplay too, the way that he plays basketball, the way that they'll double team him and he'll make like an extra pass. He can make play it the right for way. Sure, for sure. So he's not going to take as many shots because over his career, even with Golden State, that's not how he played. Like he was, he was a primary guy, but Curry was the one taking more mm-hmm. shots. And he said, "Oh, let him get him his, and then I'll get mine naturally through the game." L- look this up. I think you think I think he's going to get the same amount of shots that, as he did with Kyrie. I don't think his shots are going to go down. You think? think Would so, have eighteen yeah, or nineteen shots Let's attempted? Look, it up. look, up, look how many shots he's a. Uh, 18 or 19. Look, reference and look up a shot attempt. What do you guys think it is? 18, 19? I think it's around there. 18, 19? Hell no. He's saying like 20 some shots a game. With Kyrie? Really I don't really, I don't With Kyrie? Does, though. I don't even think he he's takes taking 20. 20 plus every season of his career. Kevin, Kevin Durant. Yeah, he probably is. Ain't no way, bro. Yeah, he's in the West. That's crazy. He's definitely on the lower he's end of superstar. Uh, attempts? Yeah, he's taking yeah, over attempts, 20. Attempts, attempts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How much is it? Go to this season. You can check his app. I'll go down to 2023. Uh, 2023. This is three pointers, field goals. Attempted. 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 Oh, he's taking 18 this year. He was taking 20 last year. I know my statistics. 18 points. It's all under 20. It's all under 20. I was right. It's the efficiency. Super efficient. Yeah. It's super like, crazy. That's what makes him one of the greatest. It's like D-Book is so efficient too. Super like, I think he's going up yeah. though. I That's think Evan going Booker going needs to be take more shots to be offense. like. Yeah, yeah they're gonna be really good. Actually, okay, I'll say this. Yeah, well, he definitely has to take more shots. It's just like no one's gonna be. I'll say this for the regular like... season, probably not. But in playoffs, he's gonna be sh- scoring way more. Like he's yeah. gonna be shooting way more. Oh, for sure. Yeah, he'll probably average sure playoffs. In the playoffs like... Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, like, you can check the what he did in the playoffs his, back then. His shot attempts in the playoffs, like in the regular 80, season, he might kind of chill out. I like think he's gonna average like thirty. D book probably. Like oh no, he's not averaging thirty. In the in the playoffs? Oh, I thought you were talking about regular season. No, 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 no. Playoffs, playoffs, he's gonna be like thirty. D book's gonna be like twenty-seven. Even Kawhi too. Kawhi super efficient. And oh, do you guys want to talk about the Nets? Y'all talking about the Suns already? Uh, let, let them talk about the Suns. You guys you want to talk, or you want to talk about, about the Nets? What is it to say about the Suns here? It's just like we it, said everything. Katie, man, Same Katie thing. is like talk about the Nets then. If you don't. he's like a ser- you know, like the the girls who are like serial oh, celebrity bro. daters. Yeah. What analogy That's like are we going to when it comes to like super teams? Yeah, dick riding. It's, fault, <laughs> it's a good team. Straight dick riding. So, if just if like you. Walk right over if a bad like like the Kardashians, you know what I'm saying? Like, if a bad falls on my lap, am I going to say no? No, bitch. <laughs> if, if you no, actively was doing pursuing these please, baddie, can I have you type shit, though? That's what it is. That's what it is. But he traded out. He, he, he requested he the trade. Yeah. He demanded it. You're going to play on the Nets with Kevin Durant? I'm not saying he's you wrong for show, it, but he did request it. And they points. send him. Joe Side did exact opposite of Kyrie. He sent him exactly where he wanted to go. They didn't well, even they negotiate didn't with other loyal. teams. They bro. respect them. They nah, respect bro. Loyal. Fuck they that. Lost, they lost assets too, though. They fed into his little. Please send me here. The first He plays games, though. I mean, he plays games and he's consistent. He did it. Why? I'm not saying they're wrong for it, but the fact that it matters is the fact that it matters. Yeah, I'm not going to disagree with you guys. He does love going to different teams. I'm just saying, like, different. Say, he say how he's winning. Already fucking, yeah. teams. But all, all superstars do it. LeBron does no, it. No, the fuck Kyrie, they LeBron, don't. LeBron, LeBron went LeBron. somewhere pause, can I pause? and then made it. LeBron went to the Lakers with Lonzo <laughs> Ball and Brandon <laughs> Ingram. Dwayne Wade wasn't already one of those guys. It Him and Chris Bosh. Miami was the only dude. time. Though. Cleveland. Miami was the only time. Kevin Durant did it three times. Same with LeBron. Oh, not with Lakers, but he did it two times. No, look, he went to Cleveland. No, 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 they didn't even person. have nobody except Kyrie. Yeah, Kyrie was him, and, and then they got they traded. They were a lottery team. They literally built up the team with their assets and traded for Kevin Love. Where is KD? It was a big three at the time. You know what Kevin Love was doing? They traded after he went there. Yeah, exactly. No, what are you talking about? They traded for Kevin Love after for after the LeBron came back already. No, but I'm saying LeBron already knew they were gonna trade for no base player. He wasn't there yet. They had assets. They had a lot of assets, right? He leaves. No, yeah, sorry, yeah, they they you, know, you know what that is? It's people that want to play with him. No, that's what it is. Oh, it's so what about Kevin Durant? He, he wants to play with people. Has oh, left. Yeah, facts, nigga. He facts, has nigga. Facts, nigga. That wants to play with him, Hudson. <laughs> Who for Kevin? People yes. want to play with LeBron. Everybody wants to play with Kevin Durant. People want to play with LeBron. All the Kevin Durant want to play with the people. Every superstar. Every superstar you want, you think wants to play with Kevin Durant. Kevin Love literally left the Timberwolves to go play with LeBron. The Timberwolves asked him. Left. They traded him. Because he, he wanted, to go, he wanted to go there. All right, so then people don't want to go and leave, play with Kevin Durant? Leave him no, play with he, he goes to play with them. James Harden wants to go play with Steph Curry. Curry. What about James Harden? Yeah, they don't even get the chance because he just dips off to a better team. What do you mean? They don't even get the chance to join up with him because he just dips off. Okay, see, for five years, wait, one, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. He couldn't help that. He was drafted there. He was and did nothing. Went to the finals, what, once? Three times. The finals? That's even worse. What do you mean he went That's two? That's even fucking worse. Four four times. Times. One time, three times. worse than one. You were Warriors. that close yeah, that three fucking times? Niggas want to talk about Eddie, Eddie, bubble rings not counting. Those are three times. Wait, is he? Don't, are you saying, wait. How many times were OKC? 
Once. Just once, yeah. That's what the fuck I would... Not oh. with Golden State. Yeah, Golden State, he'd be winning. Are you fucking see. kidding me? Yeah, but he had to go against LeBron, okay. who went to Miami with Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosh. Yeah, Russell, Russell Harden. Harden. Yeah, Russell Harden. Russell Harden. 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 Young. They were young. Baca, they were young. Burkitt, you got to tell me... You want me to look up Russell, look, Russell Harden's stats? That Reggie Jackson... The difference... Look, look. The difference between Braun and KD is that Braun... Even if Braun goes and joins a player... What are we even talking about? What are we even discussing here, though? People come to the game. Like, LeBron's super... Super teams are like created that year, so they still gotta learn how to mesh. They still gotta learn oh. how to. Oh, if I go, joined, no, 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 look, he no, joined. Cook, yeah, cook. he joined oh, Kyrie. Right, they were a lottery team, winning like fifteen games, nigga. Like, they, went, they were ass. Okay, they created. There's one thing to create a team. You still gotta like play oh, through, shit. learn how to make the team mesh. You gotta do shit. No, you don't. When you're good, KD is when you're walking good, you the teams that That's just was true. in the finals. That's true. It is true. Uh, he, KD oh, walked. Those are the teams that are just in the finals. It'll matter. I know what you're saying. Your point like, is invalid because if you're the, only... the Cavs already had assets. They had they had Kyrie that asked. They had the number one pick to trade for Kevin Love. They already had a, a I, good I, bet unit they, that they can they build have, up. That's not what he's saying, though. They, that's not what I'm Dude, saying. I got though. you. I got like, you. Look, they, look. No, no. I got, they create the team that year. You're like, talking about continuity. Yes, I'm saying like LeBron. The teams are being created, and then they got to work it out. Dude, if you're good, it doesn't matter. I'll put KD on the Warriors and see, look it what happens. Matter. So Fitz Russell definitely matters. matters. That's the thing he's arguing. Fitz definitely KD matters. goes to the Warriors who already have a team yeah. and a system established. Yeah, they build a system around best, LeBron, like though, Kevin when he was goes the best to a team. There. You have to build around it the best matter. player. No, but they, they didn't don't have build to build do shit. They didn't make any other trades. They just added KD to what they already had. Yeah, but we can use the same point for Kevin Durant because you have to you have to figure it out with Kevin Durant. Sure, you have to figure it out, but the point still stands about the roster and creating it and... Finding the players to play okay, with them. Still, Kevin Durant about, goes to players. If you're good, you're right, bro. If you're good, you'll be okay. No, but I'm saying Kevin Durant. Well, and you, like, like I said, KD won with won, won with the Warriors, but so did Andrew Wiggins. Huh? It's like Bars. they just yeah. they just they just drop Andrew Wiggins in that same little Not role. Okay, but it's the system. Obviously, it's the system. But it's the system. But it's the system. If it's based off Kevin Durant, you have to get the system is based off Curry. He was the top three player in the world. Top two. Let me say this. Let me say this. When he went to Golden State, the niggas was in the finals. I cooked them. No, when he went to Golden State, he went there and learned how to play in their system. They didn't learn how to play with Kevin Durant. He will learn to play in the Warriors system. This is the greatness of Kevin Durant. He has to learn the whole system. That system is hard. I'm not saying that's a bad thing. I'm saying it's not hard to play. It's still difficult though. It's not. No, LeBron is not. going to the Lakers. He's not. so good, he can adapt to anything. LeBron went to the Lakers, but fucking LeBron's doing him. him. He he's so same, good, he's, he's yeah. easy for him. He's That's as good okay, that, mentally so that be a, as fucking the Wiggins, towards bro. The, what? It, it speaks to his greatness, but that doesn't mean, oh, he, 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 he basically ran from the grind, though. You understand right. this? Yeah. LeBron did too. No, no he didn't. Okay, yeah, he did. He did. Finding he did too. these motherfuckers he did trading for him. No, but the way he did it is different. No, 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 that's Hustle, cap. That's the way he did it. Yeah, super cap. It's worse than the way he did it. It's the worst way KD does it. No, and then super cap for Bron too, because he was he was in Cleveland for like seven fucking years. No, he did run for. And then they ran. No, 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 no. He got lost out running. That's not running. No, like like right now, no one's gonna blame Dame if he wants to leave. If if. If Dame wants to leave right now, niggas aren't gonna be like, oh, he running from the like. Come on, you you gave them as many chances. You gave them as many chances as they could. Amari, Amari, you gave them niggas as many chances as they could. Come on, was there for seven years, I mean, being the greatest. He makes fun of Dame for not for not running from the yeah. grind. He runs from it. He's gonna say, oh, like, oh. like so. It's like Braun was there for seven years, and them niggas wouldn't put shit around him. Like that's not he. He gave him chances. Saying, yeah, he should have left. Gave him years. He should have left, but he okay. still, and then, he still ran and from then the grind. He left. Wait, that's not running from the grind. He, he did. He ran. He, he, best. he was. He, he was. The he was the best in the league. Like, he, he was on the grind. He did the grind. Yeah, he was grinding. He did the grind. <laughs> he, he, he did the grind. He them niggas in the front office was not grinding. He, he said, Mo Williams, here you go, buddy. Right. He, he, he went grinding. to Miami so, and built so a then super he leaves. team. That's... And even in Miami, they still had to create that, 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 that team. Like, Dwayne was, was there. Bro. Yeah, Dwayne Wade is good. good. And it was a decent team all together. Decent players. Dante West was good. Like, these guys aren't scrubs. We're not going to... Talk about like the teams scrub, bro. Oh, man, them niggas, so bad. What are, they, what are they though? What are they? They're not scrubs. But if LeBron what are they? walks away, they're, they're a lottery team. Role players? Yeah. I LeBron mean, plus role players. LeBron, yeah. yeah. But Dude. you're talking about you're he's talking about like these guys are like Kwame Brown type of players, bro. Come on. Okay, they're they're oh, what? Is that, are you saying he had championship rosters? No, of course not. That's why he didn't win. But so. you're talking about like they're dirt. They, they were they dirt. They were. They were dirt. They're good enough to get to the playoffs, and that's it. Like, and he carried them to the finals. Yeah. And Eric Snow was also an all star. Who talks about him? Who? So Eric Snow was also an all-star player. player. Who the fuck is that? <laughs> Who the right, fuck right, is man. that? What team he played for? Who, Eric Snow? Celtics, right? Or 
Celtics, I'm pretty sure. 76 Celtics and Cavs. Oh, Hudson. 76ers. He might have played. Yeah, he might have played. Man, I make one point, though. If Dallas Durant was still with Kyrie, right? And they got like a third superstar. Mm -hmm. Nobody would bag on him if he went to the Nets with those superstars already there. You get me? Yeah, I mean Harden went. That's there, the though. difference. That's Harden just... went. Harden went and to nobody join him. Get, nobody was mad at, at Durant. Yeah, but I'm just... you notice that? Yeah. You notice how nobody was like, "Oh, Durant's a bitch." <laughs> like, no, nobody was doing because that. Because they were expected. Because but, Katie already did that before. If the Nets had fucking Kyrie and Harden. And then KD came there. Oh, you're gonna get a lot of fucking. It, de it depends on how you do it. He did it from the free agency. Like, okay, I'm just really, telling you, can't you that. Do that. Those are two itself? different ways of of getting on those super teams. Done. Yeah, but I'm saying the Nets isn't as bad in the my Nets opinion. Wasn't bad at all. Yeah, yeah. Like what, what he did. Mean? Like he did what, what I'm talking about. More so on like, the Nets failure. Like, like yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think he yeah. wanted. Like the thing about the situation is yeah, like I get your point. Like, I don't think he would have ever requested a trade if the if the organization was competent. Like yeah. I think he could have been chilling with chilling with Kyrie, just I mean, him two plus I, role players. Honestly, but then he, the shit was so bad, he's like, I, I can't do it here. And like, there just happens to be an opportunity for me to form a super team, I, and he yeah. can't resist that. I don't, I don't like, blame the, I don't blame the organization as much as you got. I blame Kyrie more, like because. This dude has been a headache since day one and hasn't yeah. played games. Nah, he, lucky, yeah. he, 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 he deserves lucky partial blame, like, but I also deserve, like, I also say, like, yeah, the way they handled it is, is terrible. It's <laughs> also bad. like, you also made James Harden and KD want to leave. So, yes, while that's partially Kyrie, well, they, like, I think they wanted to leave, Harden wanted to leave because of Kyrie. I don't think that was the sole reason, though. Dude, he wasn't playing because of Could COVID. Be. Could be. Literally, what are they going to do? Yeah, he wasn't playing because of vaccine. Like, yeah, like, and he, it was on his, his last year of the contract, right? Like, they all, let me team up with Embiid. It's obviously but by the end of the me. season, they were already like playing together. The the brew up and lifted. How's he they just got hurt. Now? How's he supposed to? He can't look into the future. No, no, no. But I'm saying yeah, they, he left before Kyrie came back. No, no, he no. They they lifted the ban in the playoffs yeah, by the playoffs, and he just so didn't resign with the team. Ooh. So he already knew. James Harden. He, he went to Philly the next year. He, it's not like he got traded. I, I thought he got traded. No, he got traded. He got traded mid season. Yeah, last year. He got traded mid season. No, that playoffs. He did play a playoff series with them though. And Kyrie, oh, that was uh, the that season was a, before when he got hurt, oh, that was the hamstring, yeah. That was okay. When they beat yeah, yeah, yeah. Boston and I lost see. the, okay. the toe. I'm just mixing yeah, it up, yeah. Because yeah. he did play for them. I was like, they definitely had an offseason yeah. with him on a team yeah. still. Yeah, he was That's on when they're all going to resign. That's when KD resigned first. He was on the team for a year and a half. They're going to resign, but then the Kyrie had one year. And then Kyrie was like, oh, am I getting the vaccine? And then everything switched from that. And Kyrie didn't play any games beforehand. Like, he barely played any games with KD. I think him and KD, within a four-year span, has played 82 games or, like, 81 games. Like, that's terrible. And Kyrie's the main reason why. Like, KD, he'll play every game <laughs> until he gets hurt and then come back and play every game. No problems with KD, but Kyrie, there's this, the vaccine, and there's something, this, so, like, there's always something happening. They should have traded Kyrie instead of James Harden. That was the... That was who's going to take him, though? He's not, he's not, his value is, like, depleted. But, but like, Kyrie's even looking at it back then, no, looking, like, Kyrie's looking at what they got from now... I don't think the package would be right? that much different. Dude, protected like, first round, maybe it was protected pick, honestly, but the same. I players. think that's they got a really good package for him because who's signing Kyrie to a four-year max? Also, it was bro? just New York. He could have got traded to the Mavericks and still Nobody. played there because it was, it was only New York that had that ban on him. Yeah, like it no. was only the state of New oh, York. Yeah, no, actually, I mean, somewhere and like some other places, but yeah, like New York was heavy. Yeah, yeah, like, Texas for sure ain't have that. Yeah, he shit. wasn't playing games. The narrative on Kyrie was terrible last year. Like you're not gonna get really as much value as talking about the first year, like before the back, like. The year of the vaccine shit, if they would have shipped him then, they could have just Oh, like, what? You have to see how it puts out, though. You can't ship him. No, no, I'm hard. saying... Oh, you're talking about, talking about when he had hard. When he had hard no, I'm games. saying when he, when he wasn't playing the home games, right? That's yeah. what I'm talking about. You're saying the but, ban was only on New York, right? Yeah, but I'm saying... Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They could have traded him then. Like, yeah, his, yeah. his name was still yeah, bad, and they didn't yeah, want yeah. that, but it's like... They could have kept Harden at that point, and... Build with those two. Yeah, Harden and Yeah, Harden and KD Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It would have been a better fit. It just would have been maybe hard to convince KD of that. I don't know if he would have been like, yeah, we came here with Kyrie, and now he's a gone. Depends on what you got back for him. That's true, because they went as a pair in the first place. Like, Even now, like, who's going to sign Kyrie to a four-year? Hey, looking back at that Harden trade, that shit was terrible, too, bro. They got fucking fleeced out of their fucking minds. How did they know, though? How did they know? We all should have seen it coming, to be honest. Like Right now, the way he's playing, going to be this bad, though? Ben Simmons is twice as much, but we should have seen a decline. He's just not getting back up to that. He said, it's going to take me time to get back. Fucking Simmons? Yeah, he said that. 
Can it's they just like formally yeah, retire him? Like just been, like, say give up, don't play ball anymore. <laughs> don't play basketball. The dude does not want to hoop. shoot the basketball. Bro, doesn't want to play offense in a game. Like and he and he's it, six nine just and athletic. Like come on, you gotta do much, bro. So, like, when he when he turns it up, he'll score like four lay- like three layups in a row and then he'll stop. Like yeah, have open layups too and not even take them. Bro, yeah. just, he just needs to like get it back. I know it's like his like he's just a, I don't know he's a bitch or something. I don't know. <laughs> he's a bum, bro. Dude, he's like that. Stay that shit. No, because not not like maybe in a fucked up way, but like still like like dude score like dog. You used to be an all star. Star. What, what, like, come on! What like, the fuck happened? Dude, I seen the summer league highlights. I'm like, this is not the same player. Bro. It's not. It just wow. isn't. Wow! Stop! Stop dating Dude, IG models, bro. Check out his high school highlights. You think it was better in high school than he is now? He's like, Australia, bro. He regressed. High school Benson How do you regress? Old. Turn Michael Carter Williams. They drafted Michael Carter Williams too. <laughs> oh my god, Michael yeah. Carter too. We'll see if he gets better. That's a little disrespect. Did we grade the Brooklyn trade? Them though, I think that I think this was the most obvious. You know what? Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. but we can grade we it. Have to see the Phoenix A. Are we all say yeah, A plus yeah. or A? Bro? A oh, A plus A plus plus plus. Okay, so let's I grade, think let's grade Brooklyn. Let's all grade Brooklyn because this is subjective or yeah, this is very interesting. How you guys? I, I I think Brooklyn. I'll give him a C plus or a B minus around there. That wait, territory. Wait, the whole deadline or just the no, just the this sun, is one this trade. Is right, this this exact trade. The Nets. The Nets. Yeah. Uh, me right. I'll give him a B. A B. Ah. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna give him a B too. I think they could have got more in the player aspect, but yeah. picks wise, they did the most they could. I think wow. you got Rudy Gobert. Rudy Gobert got a bigger haul than for Kevin. Huh? Yeah, but they it's like that was so fucking that stupid that they just can't use that as a blueprint. They gotta just like get that out the window now. They just gotta be stupid. like, yo, Timberwolves out there being nah, mentally changed, challenged. Like, has effect, he changed, he changed, he changed, has yeah. effect. Like, you know what? I'll compare that to. It's like it's like. It sounds, sounds fucked up, but you know that weird kid in the corner. You just let him do Damn. his thing. You don't really talk it's to him. The Timberwolves right now, like you, you don't pay attention. You don't figure that into your life. So. No, but they changed the game though. They changed the atmosphere of how everything's it's being played right now. They did, but you, dude, you know, Jared Vanderbilt. Like, if you told me two years ago Jared Vanderbilt was worth the worth the first round pick, I would have laughed in your face. Yeah. Or they they're uh, <laughs> saying, saying like bro. rumors. Picks, picks like fucking skyrocketed in yeah. value, like. Because they saw how bad some teams got dirty with picks, and it's like. You don't want to be that the team true, done yeah. dirty. You want to be doing couple, teams dirty. Yeah, because now a couple of niggas have like fucking. Look what the Celtics did with all them damn picks that held on to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at they got a fucking loader. They roster. only got two first round picks for Paul Pierce and Kevin Garnett when they were like decent. Imagine what they would have gotten now. Dude, and those, NBA. those, no, no, they got yeah, all those like, picks from the Nets. Yeah, it was how many were it? It was the Jason Tatum, Jalen Brown, and then two more picks, I think, right? Yeah, it was. Um, one was Peyton Pritchard and one was Grant Williams. Yeah, so PP. Good PP. Imagine what they would have got now. They would have hauled them like freaking. Ten still, years of yeah. draft picks, bro. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> for real. All ten they years for first round picks. Boston fucking... draft picks. Oh, bro, like, all right. They're still decent. Great for the Nets. Great so for the Nets. They became so booty too in the Nets. Great for the Nets. B plus. You said one, yeah. Right. I said B plus. I mean, I like. I like the what's it? I like the Suns boy. I think. I no, think they're. Yeah, they're like Kel's going to average twenty. He's going to average twenty. Players on that team now. I don't know. I don't think he's capable of doing that. I don't think he got the back. He's going to get. He can average twenty, bro. He's going to do it. I see. Claxton ain't going to fucking. I wasn't familiar with your game. He's averaging seventeen right now on the Suns. Like he's having a career year. He's his last five games. He scored over twenty. Like ain't nobody there demanding the ball. Score over twenty points. He's not demanding the ball though. It's like no, he's not. he can't Roy score. Cam was playing today. This right. man's demanding the ball. That's how the oldness were. Right. He's gonna chill out though. Yeah, he's yeah, gonna get The coach is gonna be like, nigga, like, yeah. okay, I understand, <laughs> nigga, I understand you ain't him, but like, let, he's come on, I understand. Let, let's get through these next trades. Uh, we spent a lot of time on the Suns one, but there are some better ones down the line. This is the next one, small one. You can talk about it if you want. If not, I want to blow past it because it's basically nothing. I want to talk about it. Celtics get Mike Muscala, Thunder get Justin Jackson, two second round picks. Are they gonna Are they gonna buy a Mike or no? He's gonna stay and play, or what? He's just gonna be a, another guy is better than Luke Cornett. Like, yeah, stretch four, he's a shooter too. He's Shout a shooter. The th- Oklahoma City legend. He's been there for like so bro, long. He was playing it against LeBron in that game where yeah, he was breaking the record off. and he was stroking it, bro. Yeah, one way. That's Never did that for the Lakers when when Mike when we had Mike when Lakers had Mike. Mike shooting, scene, bro, I swear to God, yeah. Mike hit like four threes in a row. I'm like he never even made that many as a Laker. This is ten year old bullshit. Like, he's been shooting pretty well with Oklahoma. It's like people get next to LeBron. From the Lakers, your three point percentage at least two percent is close. Oh, percent dip from forty. Ah, well, if Dino shoots like 20, I'm going to get so mad or something. 30? If Beasley got to be shooting, he's a, one of the best he shooters. Has read, so. He has to be. He has to be. be. Like, if that nigga falls off, I'm like, this nigga, LeBron just must be cursed right now. Like, it's the Lakers press up, bro. Nobody wants to put blue on that nigga, dude. Like, All right. This bro. trade grade, any, anybody give a fuck? Nah, Justin Jackson ain't playing basketball. This. Give fuck. I'm going to give a skip. Next one. This is technically part of that Nets trade. So this is the, the Nets to get Jay Crowder from the Suns, and they reroute Jay Crowder to the Bucks who've been trying to get him all fucking season. Uh, and they get... 
This is where them second round picks. They get yeah. five second round picks for Jay like, Crowder, bro. I looked. I seen. I came out of work. I looked at my phone. Crowder. I five second round. Five picks. second round picks. No, I think they gave three. They gave three to Indiana and two to Brooklyn. Yeah, they ended up shipping okay. two of those uh, picks yeah, to Indiana. Yeah. We'll talk about that later, but I'm taking everything in a vacuum uh, in yeah. here. So I did. Nice. Have a who? No. I like this trade for them. Who? I like this trade for them. Let me say something about Jay oh, Crowder. Okry, go ahead. Jay Crowder is a 3D right? player who doesn't shoot well threes and doesn't well defend anymore. That's Jay Crowder he nowadays. He just he just doesn't oh, do anything. Jay Crowder he follows the much. PJ Tucker role. Yeah. Exactly. And PJ Tucker is a nobody right now. Exactly. Huh? Yes, oh, PJ no, Tucker. No, no, no. PJ Tucker runs against you're cardio. Not be saying that. Though. <laughs> nah, <laughs> see, yeah. he don't got that dog in him. We'll like see. Hey, we'll see. Playoffs, we'll see when Jay Crowder goes over oh, eight in the playoffs, and see, he's getting though. cooked. We'll, we'll see. see. In a regular season, he ain't doing shit. Playing ten minutes a game, probably. He's an enforcer, just like PJ Tucker but is. In the playoffs, that's what you say. Well, someone can't do shit. Fucking hockey, hustling. What does Pat do? What does Pat do? Fucking hockey. I never said he was good. Hold up, hold up. Let me get this analogy. But he provides value to teams. Teams keep signing his ass. He does not know And you ask me, I don't know how Pat Bev signs. You don't see the game like that. Somebody's, somebody's beating me up. You're not gonna help me. Like Jay Crowder. Of course. He's yeah, gonna get so ejected that's what Jay for you. Crowder's gonna do Jay too. Crowder's gonna get ejected yeah, for you. You need someone that's gonna Jay, have that pressure, see, okay, right? The that's thing gonna, is, Tucker might really back. fuck you up. Tucker might actually put hands on you. Oh, Crowder's Jay. gonna talk shit and then not do. Shit. But they don't need anyone the close to that. They need somebody to do something. Him do it on the side. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 who's gonna do it? Grayson Allen ain't doing shit. He's injuring players on purpose. Like yeah. Grayson Allen, the white guy. Nobody likes that. Yeah, yeah, the Bucks nobody likes that. Even folks. close. At least yeah, yeah. Jake Crowder, somewhat a little bit. Like, like, a little bit of dog. He's not PJ, but he got the little dog. Because boy doing it. Because let the Nazis go get cooked out. Let the Nazis get fully ejected. He got that Pomeranian in him. He contributes to winning basketball too. Pomeranians be barking. He's been to the finals twice and then to the Western Conference finals. That's because he's been on every single NBA team of. All yeah, time, you know, it's 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 started for them though. The playoffs, Bro, really if you think Jay Crowder still adds value, we'll see him in the playoffs, him. and we'll keep talking. I'll, I'll bet you he has value. I bet you has like a, a game where he hits like what's four value? Threes. Like two threes? No, he's gonna have two a game threes? where he hits like three or four threes. Yeah, and then another game where he and plays good defense everything. and yeah. plays good defense or gets cooked. <laughs> no, he's it's a hit or miss for him. It's yeah. a hit or miss, but he he can help you win a game. He's the guy that can help you win a game either on defense or offense by getting hot or by like being annoying on defense. Like in a regular season, I agree. It doesn't mean shit. But in the playoff time comes, I promise you're going to see that. That's why teams want Patrick Beverly. He's going to be irritating, annoying people, getting under people's skin, like throwing Kawhi off his like game. That trade. He's a buyout. That's so crazy. He was like, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait, I'll wait. Uh, you got to stop talking, bro. <laughs> okay, great, great to trade, great to trade for uh, just for Milwaukee. I guess. For Milwaukee, Milwaukee, I'll give him a C plus W. Give him a B. Give him I'll give him a B as well. C plus. I say B minus is good. I mean, there's, there's there was better three and D players in the trade market, but they still have the assets for those three. Yeah, yeah. yeah ain't getting no yeah, OG. Or... I just don't think oh, I okay. guys think this guy's good, bro. I'm just you know, like... Royce O'Neal be that much better. That's <laughs> another good OG. <laughs> Jay Carter is getting like to Gabe's point. He's getting a little older. Oh, this is the three teamer. So they also gave Indiana some shit too. Huh? Oh, we have to talk about uh, Serge Ibaka. Finally, get some. George Hill's return to Indiana. These yeah, players are dude. not going to play a single minute of basketball <laughs> for the Pacers. <laughs> yeah, he played with Paul George. He played with Paul George, a, played Paul George back in the day. What's his name? George Hill. Actually, oh, George Hill. I think he yeah. will. George Hill. Is. I think yeah, he will provide twelve. Uh, Where do you go? Back to Indiana. Uh, he's going to get bought out. Uh, uh, or maybe, maybe be like. He stays up, get better in presence and help them. Like, yeah, he's he's never had a burner like that. Five he's minutes not a game, maybe. Well, because they got McConnell. He stays. Not plays. He just not stays. He's a good dude. veteran presence yeah, for that team. To, like, for sure, for sure. Especially for Halliburton. He's a good leader for him. To teach the war is a victory cigar. You only put him in blowouts. <laughs> Serge Ibaka is going to go somewhere. But he's kind of old. Like, I don't think he can really help a team dramatically. His best shit with a shot blocking. And then he got a burner. Yeah, if you need, like, if you need, like, just any sort of. Veteran depth, like I would have said, the Clippers if they um they're the ones who shipped them off in the first place. Yeah, yeah. yeah. they could have got like, him back though. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. They needed, like, they but they help. got it back. I mean, he help. Oh yeah, bro, that rocket shit is. <laughs> we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Oh, John. <laughs> the next trade. Next the trade. Next trade. Next trade. I don't know. You want to grade Brooklyn or Indiana on this? Mm-hmm. Brooklyn. Oh, I don't care. I mean, really. two picks are just we'll Indiana. Fuck. These guys aren't playing for them. It doesn't matter. Skippers. So yeah, next trade we got TB. Thomas Bryant. For the Thomas Lakers, going to Bryant. the Denver Nuggets for Devon Reed, three second round picks. Three seconds. Uh, good for Denver. They need a backup center. That's not DeAndre Jordan. That's so. true. Thank God they the, need him. The, 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 Defensively, Thomas is on his uh, contract year too, so I yeah. guess he can get an extent. Also, it, uh, for the Lakers, it recoups the picks you gave for Rui, so like it's just it. like not giving up any picks. Great. None for Rui, basically. Yeah, and Devon, I mean, he's whatever he's else. Play, I right? say, I, 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 we can grade like, it right now. It's pretty obvious. I, it's nothing crazy to talk about. I say B plus for us, for Lakers. What about for Nuggets? Really? Nugg
Uh, ah, B plus is pretty. I would give a high grade to the Nuggets than the Lakers on this one. Why are they B plus for the Lakers? Thomas Bryant lacks defense. I don't think he's he very does. good defensively. They, they're, they're, like he's a really bad defender compared to Wenyan Gabriel. Oh, Wenyan yeah, Gabriel's yeah, yeah. like a he's dog on defense. But it's still an upgrade, major upgrade over DeAndre. It is. It is. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. Is good for them. They have a solid backup center. Because bro, this guy was starting most of the time for LA without AD. He was dropping like 2010, 2012, 20. Like yes, small sample size, but the fact that he's able to do that. Ryan? Thomas Bryant, yeah, for the Lakers. Damn. The crazy yeah, thing is, though, though, he said... Well, I like for a little bit, why he And he requested the trade, too, no, by the way. that's what I'm saying, though. Yeah. He requested a trade saying, I want a big role, but you, because you're playing behind AD. But now you're playing behind Jokic, The best so, center in the league, so, buddy. Like, I mean, he gets all the backup center minutes, so now... You know no, what his role's going to yeah. be. Like, if he stayed with the team, you don't know if Vanderbilt's going to get more minutes than right, him. Right, right. Like, you don't know... Small they they Lakers, give yeah, Wayne some fit. minutes here and there, like... Yeah, right now, know your role. The Lakers roster has been fluid all year. Yeah, so, like, at least you know you're going to be behind Jokic and you can focus on what you yeah, so he'll get like a solid 15, 20 minutes a night. Yeah, it's better for everybody. And this also helps the Lakers because we had a lot of talent, like a lot of young guys that needed minutes. Another guy we don't have to worry about. Now we just got the picks and we got picks, which is what we, 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 just, we got a center back got later. Ass, so I guess it's like ass, it, it cancels ass. out. That's why I said it was both very even for me. I think it was an even just trade. Great, yeah, just great both of the teams right here. I'll give Denver, I'll give them both a C. I'll mm. give average they did what they need. I'll give Denver a B and I will give the Lakers a C. Plus. I give the I give Denver a C and I give the Lakers a B minus. I like that we got. I like the Lakers. I I agree. All right, next trade. This is another Blazers L incoming. <laughs> also a Hornets L actually fat Hornets oh, L's, L's, L's 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 L's. No, I didn't. So, so well, he's training. finding out live reaction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Remember what I told you? That stat's still undefeated. The Lakers get Matisse Stiebel. <laughs> Sixers get Jalen McDaniels. Hornets get multiple second round picks and Svi Mokailik rerouted from whatever fucking trade we talked about earlier. What does multiple even mean? Uh, initial reaction to this trade. Let's go. Initial reaction. <laughs> I don't know what the hell Portland's doing. They, Josh Hart is better than Matisse Stiebel. And he's literally like, he can shoot and like play defense a little bit below Matisse Stiebel. Like, what are they doing with that trade? I don't know. Jalen's good though for 76ers. Yeah, yeah. Saying, like, good points off. McDaniels the bench. is good. Yeah, he's yeah. good. He's three and D guy, like a young three and D guy who can potential to get better, solidify himself. This know. is great for them off the bench. That's like the one thing they're missing. They only really got Tobias Harris. Yeah, right? yeah. Now they got another no, wing. Tyrese is on the bench too. Tyrese. No, but I mean oh, wing, wing players. Yeah. yeah, wing players. Yeah, so. that's really good for them actually. Because Montrez can't play in the playoffs. Like you cannot play that guy. <laughs> he cannot get. Still minutes, nigga. Hmm? So he still get minutes. <laughs> yeah, he get back yeah, he gets backup. But not in the playoffs. You cannot play that man. And Zybo, exactly. for me, bro, you can't you can't have him out there because of the the, the right, liability. Like, and like, Josh Hart is better. I don't understand high? what this crap is. Whoa, whoa, looking at like that 18, 18 or something. His offensive liability is ridiculous. Yeah, just three points a game. Thibel. I guess they need defense. I mean, I I guess. And this guy's a pure no defender. Point, and, and and the worst this... part is they traded away a defender too. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Like, in 2023, bro, there's no reason to have a nigga who just yeah, does shoot. just defense. Like, bro, like it's not fucking 2009. We don't need no Tony ball. Allen's over. Yeah, it's like, like, four bro. on five on offense. Hey, Tony Allen was a dog. He was a dog too. That's why I was gonna say he was a dog. Three pointers, a little bit. Kobe respected him. Even yeah, even Tony Allen. We'll find out. I think they will start with T's. They, they start defense. sharp at the three. Uh, I think they need. They really need defense. Trent fucking team. Watford. I don't know, dude. I can't believe. I but can't Bible believe can't guard every single player, though. That's a problem. Dude, they better not start this guy. I. I, I yeah, it's we'll, we'll find out. Was Josh Hart starting? Maybe though. Maybe Simons and Lillard are such good shooters that it can help him like blend in a little more. Yeah, but I mean, like, because those fools are elite at shooting threes. So. Yeah, but like, they're gonna make Thibel like play so. They're gonna make him switch everything in. Bad, but, like, that's why you want him on the like, they're, bad, they're gonna make him like, a running dog. <laughs> It's just like, how do you not, like, you can't slash? I, mean, I guess either, they like, get a defender and then they get a shooter. Yeah, like, you can't, you can't, you can't even bro, slash. You, can't can't slash. Slash. you, you guys want to rate him? So, rate him? Yeah, this no one lobs, is somewhat understandable because like, they got Lillard and Simons helping him a little bit. I just don't understand because Josh Hart can shoot and play defense a little bit le worse than Matisse. He just, they just, he don't want to be there. He, he's going to leave in free agency, so that's, I guess. You can go first on Markdown, rate him. Yeah, go ahead. Philly, Philly. Philly, Portland, and Charlotte, rate him. He. Oh shit! <laughs> me? Oh, okay. Go ahead. Um, I give Philly a B. I give Portland a, like a D plus, and Charlotte I'll give like a C. Yeah, I agree with the Philly one. I'll give them a B. Portland I'll give them a C because they actually do need. What B. did I say? I said D plus. Yeah. Yeah, I stick with that. Sorry. <laughs> I stick with it. I stick with it. Charlotte that. DNF. Don't need an answer. <laughs> um. Yeah. I'll give. I'll actually give Philly A minus. I like this pickle for them. Portland, I'm gonna give them a C plus because I said, like you said, they need a defense. So somewhat, 
And but, Charlotte, but, I'll give them a fucking a D plus. I don't know. But, it, but they downgraded kept, though. You kept <laughs> Gordon Hayward and, and traded the, the younger three and D wing. I don't know what what they're doing over Michael yeah. Jordan. Crazy. <laughs> there's no, there was yeah, no yeah, reason to trade Jalen. Right. I can't yeah. give Portland a high grade when they lose on a tr- like they they got a negative. This only guy. This guy sucks. Even though the like, trade though. The like, trade. Yeah, but Thibault sucks. He's like mid. He's a great defender. Go, okay, but great defense, generational defender. Sorry, y'all probably saw a crazy jump cut in the podcast because camera problems but uh we're gonna revisit one of the trades the last thing we talked about i'm pretty sure you guys are gonna see matisse Thibel trade i'm not sure where that cut off yep. yeah um so regrade uh the trades real quick just in case they didn't hear for blazers sixers but i think i said d plus for the blazers because i didn't like that okay see, and then i gave a c pl- i gave a c to a philly because they got mcdaniels okay and then no great for no great for the hornets <laughs> Yeah, I gave. Uh, yeah, I said I, I, I didn't give a fuck. The I boys didn't C, give a fuck. You good? Yeah. Actually, I really don't care. Actually, no, I'm a. I really fan don't too. care. You're uh, an every team a, fan, bro. He's a, well, I'm a hard fan of winning fan, teams. So I'm a hard <laughs> fan. I'm a hard <laughs> fan. So a B for Philly. I like we need right. for Portland, and I don't care for Charlotte. Okay, and then for me, I got. I'm gonna give Portland a C plus, Sixers a minus. Boom. Next trade, Boom. we got a small one. We also talked about it. Y'all didn't see it, but it's a small <laughs> one, so we'll get through it. Suns get Basley, Thunder get Sarge, two second round picks. Sarge is better than Baisley, and they need one now, so no. And yeah, the, and the <laughs> only reason they traded him is because he's up for a contract. They don't want to pay him. Makes sense, though. They got some draft capital back. Young, young little nigga. <laughs> All right. We also talked about this trade. Bones Highland going to Clippers for a two-second round pick for the Nuggets. We all said this is a great trade for them because, yeah. you know, young player under contract. He doesn't really compete with anybody for point guard minutes there. They can actually have him as an asset mm-hmm. moving forward as True part of young guard. players. Not really. Mm. But Not really. <laughs> that's why I said. That's they're, why I said. Get his two two very guard. opposite of a true point, point guard. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're, he's the only point guard right now. Thank you. Yeah. Tec- he's technically a point guard. Right. Right. No, he said true maker. point guard as in no, like. I mean, like, I mean like for the Clippers. Oh, okay, okay, no okay. I get what you're saying. Point. Only no, point guard. Only point guard. Fucking idiot bitches. We all gave her like an A pretty much. I said W. A A's A's all around. Yeah, A plus. Okay. Now let's get into the trade. We talked about it. I'm gonna recap it for my man's yeah. uh, time to collect your thoughts a little bit. Collect your thoughts. So initially, this trade was James Wiseman going to the Detroit Pistons for or Jeez. Sadiq Bay going to the Golden State Warriors. But later, Sadiq Bay gets rerouted to the Atlanta Hawks. Warriors get five second round picks from the Atlanta Hawks, Oof. which they reroute to the Portland Trailblazers for Gary Payton Oof. second. Um, and then Portland gets the, the second round picks and Kevin Knox a salary filler. So Warriors fan, let us know your take now. Let us know. How All do you right. feel? Yeah. So when I saw the, I knew we were going to trade you on James Wiseman when the day started for sure because of the luxury tax. Because thing. they could have saved 131 million cap space. Yeah. And he's not, he's not enough <laughs> like, to spend 130 million. On. <laughs> if he was like Lamelo <laughs> or, Anthony, million, dude. or Anthony Edwards, since they're both in the same draft class, but he would have done it hundred percent. But like you, you can't really keep this dude because of uh, how he's been performing. Well, let's just say that. So I understood like this the trade. And when I saw they got traded, he traded for Sadiq Bay. I was like, okay, that's good enough. Like I thought that we we're gonna try to trade for OG or um, Pascal with him because uh, maybe they wanted to rebuild. But I saw the Jakob trade, so I was like, probably not. They got Sadiq, and I was like, okay, that's good enough. <laughs> we're making moves out here. You yeah, might yeah, have to share them for somebody else, or if, even if he stays, is a good addition to the team. He's been in the league for a few years and he knows what he's doing. I think he'll develop Good crazy over there. Like the nigga, yeah. they had to stop that nigga from hooping. He could tell you with the, the Warriors development. Easily. Yeah, with that, that type of drive with the Warriors development, he might you never know where that nigga yeah. gonna and be. The, yeah, like, if, he, if he stays, like then I saw they traded him for five second round picks. I'm like, huh? Five second round picks? <laughs> Y'all in <laughs> on like, the? But then we need second round picks for. We're, we're trying to win now. My whole philosophy is that I don't care about the young players. Like the only <laughs> young player you keep. Fuck is, them kids. Yeah, yeah, fuck no, them just keep Kaminga because he's a really he's really good. The like, cum bucket. Yeah, he's a good backup oh, to Draymond. Oh my <laughs> God. That's, that's, that's his nickname. nickname. That's his nickname. Who's the cum bucket? Kaminga. JK. Like, Who gave him that fucking nickname? <laughs> oh, no. I didn't. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> cum oh, bucket. Right. I said you can trade everybody else, but keep Kaminga pool. Obviously, we already extend pool. Just keep Kaminga. Give your picks. We have all our first round picks. Every pick in history. You just trade them away. We have Stephen Curry. He's still contracted. He's gonna be the best player we'll ever have in franchise history. Push it. Push his agenda forward to yes. being greater. All right. I don't care about the, like I'm, what were you trading for picks for? You know. I was like, maybe we're trying to get for OG. Maybe we're going right. for OG. I saw Sham say we're going for OG. And I did see that video. I thought yeah. it was going to happen. Right, maybe we're going for Pascal too, a bigger trade, because we're trying to compete with for the KD offer. Like, 
We don't have that many years left. Draymond might be gone next year. We're trying to compete, man. Wiggins locking up his ass down, though. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Right. Yeah. <laughs> but Wiggins is going to turn it on. Oh, man. I don't even know if we're going to even compete against him. All right, finish now, the dude. trade, though. Finish the trade. <laughs> he's having... He's like, yeah, he's having... I don't even know how to compete. He's just can't bay, like, like, since the... I, I know... Yeah, better off just keeping just keep bay, like. I know the Raptors are asking for something crazy if we didn't get OG, because I knew we were probably going to give... Some of our first rounders to get OG, right? But they're probably asking for five first rounders yeah, and the second for someone. Like, oh, for sure. Yeah, sure. I was like, and okay. the young players, you can tell the, players. the kids. Yeah, man. Uh, I was like, okay, the tread deadline. I actually saw hands. some shit. They wanted Kuminga, and they, you guys didn't want to. Oh yeah, him. they're not gonna give up Kuminga. Yeah, sure. Kuminga's nice, huh? Yeah, yeah he has good. a lot. Of OG's good too. He's not. I mean, Kuminga's younger. He's nineteen. Well, OG's better right now. If you're he's, talking about win now, he's on a rookie contract. Yeah, yeah. I'm not saying. Yeah, yeah. OG, yeah, Kuminga. Oh, danger with OG is that he could leave too. Like he could just say, I don't want to be here. He could. Yeah. But then uh, they said that we're not going to use these second round picks. There's no reason in keeping them. And Gary Payne it. is a great addition to this team. This is exactly what we need. Gary Payne. And so they <laughs> had to give up. And they couldn't resign him last year because of the luxury. Luxury taxes is like crazy. They finessed. Yeah. He went to Portland to rehab his injury and came back. back. Yeah, that's kind of crazy. Insane. Yeah. 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 I, was, I mean, still a lot of picks, but like, it's and he don't even have to gel, bro. He just goes in. He already knows <laughs> yeah, how to play like, with these guys. Yeah. Damn, at the end of the day, don't the days work. At the end of the day, we basically drafted Gary Payne with the second overall pick. <laughs> and, uh, we don't say like ball, that, bro. man. <laughs> That's the what I'm thinking about, it, bro. <laughs> On my way here, I'm like, yeah, really got, it's Gary Payne, man. We really got Gary Payne. Hassan, you just know the allegations, like, know the allegations are going to come off. Hey, man, he won. Hey, they won a chip with him. And the Honestly, crazy thing is, he's going to have opportunity. They said they're going to start yeah, him. Yeah. And he's going to prove that he has some skill level and he could be at least an NBA player, I think. I'm I really like, why is he? I really don't know. He was, he was competing hey, he was for minutes, like you said He was before. a decent piece last year. Like, but you, see, you see how bad the, the defense got when he left. Like, GP. But now GP. there's no pressure on him. Like, he didn't have to be good. Like, they're going to let him do something. There is, because shit. you're competing. Okay, but they're gonna, they're, the leash is longer. You're playing, competing for I, championships. I, I so. You don't have a long leash. If you go to Detroit, you're you make some mistakes. You're spot. No, but, but Stu is making that shit. Jalen Duran. I talking about Gary Payton. No, I'm saying, bro. I'm saying oh, James oh, Wiseman. Uh, Duran makes mistakes. He's young. Stewart does dumb shit still. So oh, yeah. it's not like he's... Ivy does some dumb, dumb shit. That's what I'm saying. They're all equal. <laughs> On the Warriors, you can't be doing that stuff because they got championship aspirations. But you got to think about his his career trajectory so far. Came into the Warriors, top three organization in the league. Okay. I mean, doesn't fit. Gets hurt. He's labeled as injury prone well, he sucks and he lost Sorry. guy we're trading Sadiq Bay for yeah, a second died. pick it's like, not what, a great what are talking about? trade yeah. yeah so he's he's going into the, the second team of his career if this doesn't work out the trajectory of his career is shot oh, oh yeah yeah he's no competing for minutes done. against four players well, you gotta he's starting get right now but it's not cooking yeah well yeah like it's, he's, a, it's maybe a change of scenery what have you, like yeah, maybe, maybe, what, what have we seen that it's gonna say that oh James Wiseman's gonna be him he hasn't played much at all period that's why I can't say I haven't even seen much either him. and maybe that that's his downfall he doesn't play much but i'm assuming he gets he's gonna get an opportunity for sure yeah. he's gonna get at least 20 minutes a game for for a consistent amount of games that's always not a system is not as hard like the warriors right. system is terrible like really hard there's to really know. no system here yeah. right now no k basketball screen yeah yeah they're ball, playing pickup you know. basketball honestly yeah. I, ivy's just chucking up well, 30 footers bro he i've seen him exactly have like, fun. They, <laughs> they got players that do dump shit on that team already like killian he's throwing dumbass passes i i be chucking up 30 footers make sure you have and i don't know why <laughs> um, this is his chance. Yeah, this is his last chance. They could to get, get a one B next year or two. I don't know why they're training for so many centers. Uh, yeah, I don't understand least. that. They I must. Mean, they must the want like, like the, the reclamation project team. Like, they they might. They, but, but I don't blame them because you're giving up fucking nothing. So I mean, can, Sadiq didn't want to be there anyway. Well, like they signed Bogey, they extended yeah. him. Too. So it's like I don't blame him for taking a chance. Like he was a second overall pick. There was something there. So they're just like hoping, taking a shot in the dark. You trade Sadiq, who don't want to be there. You don't really want to play him that much anyway. You take a shot in the dark. Maybe he, you know, change the scenery, helps him at least be a, a, a competent player. And then you could flip him for some. Like let's say he rebuilds some value, so you could just flip him for the same shit at least. You know what I mean? I don't know why Atlanta wanted him either, but. Who, Bay? Yeah. He's talking about Wiseman. No, yeah, yeah no, I'm talking about saying, Wiseman. Like, I'm just saying, I'm just It's good depth for them. Uh, DeAndre Hunter, John Collins, AJ Griffin, they just got yeah, options now. But you think Atlanta got into the mix? But it's just Atlanta got into the mix? Is that what you're saying? Like, why Atlanta got involved? No, why is, why is he on the team? Like, why did, why did Atlanta want to You're saying, why, yeah. why Atlanta, Atlanta wants to be Bay? Yeah, that's what That's what I'm saying. Like, you're wondering that too? Yeah, I don't know. It's just options, though. It's good options. Good depth. Like, it's fine. That's not going to help him win. Yeah, it's, it's not moving the needle. Like, bro, they're not going to win a championship. Yeah, yeah, like, they're not I mean, winning a championship. Now they got CD Bay. Like, right, but he's a good player. Like, yeah, he's like, a good player. They gave up yeah, like, Kevin Knox, bro. Like, shitty ass it, it's, 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 a, it's an instant upgrade for nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but, yeah, it doesn't do shit for them. Obviously, it's not going to. It's a 
The Deke Bay is not taking you like Kevin Knox is like the block over scenario. the top. Like, it's just that. It's just crazy. Yo, Sydney so dropped fifty points last I, season. I don't bro. know what Golden State's the, the direction they're heading to now with with, with Kate, the KD. Obviously, it changes like organizations' paths on how fast they want to move and how slow they mm-hmm. want to move. Golden State, uh, that young and old stuff don't work, bro. Like next year, like or the off season, we gotta cash in right. those assets. Huh? Yeah, everything that we have, like. Just trade the first rounders, bro. That, that's how. I'm mad at this because they had to trade him to save the cap yeah, space. Yeah, I like Gary Payton too. He, he yeah. got the money that he deserved that we should have paid him, but we couldn't yeah. have. And you weren't getting more than this. Yeah. Like, no, it is. He was his value was all time low. Like, he yeah. wasn't gonna rebuild it with you guys anyway. So it's like just wash your hands with the situation. Yeah, yeah. It's fine. Man, we wasted the second pick, man. So fourth, it happens though. You can't hit all of them. Yeah, we hit on Clay and Steph. I, and I would say you hit Kuminga <laughs> so far yeah, too. Yeah, I say like and Jordan. Yeah, Kuminga. You Kuminga's a hit. Kuminga's a hit. You got pulled at the back end of the yeah. first round. I think we'll get rid of Moody next year, honestly. This is a nothing trade. I ain't reading this one. Scarce and Matthews to the Hawks. Oh, my God. Contending. No, okay. I actually like him. Though. He's a good shooter. Okay, bro. But, again, same thing with Sadiq yeah. Bey. He ain't <laughs> doing shit. This one? Uh, yeah, they got... No, 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 no. no. We'll talk <laughs> about that right now. But yeah. this one, Garrison Matthews, Bruno Fernando. Oh, actually, let's grade this trade. We didn't grade this last trade. Oh, the like Warriors four trade. teams, bro. I don't know what... Trade. You don't have to grade... Fee- uh, El- for Sa- El- for, um, what's it? Portland. Oh, down. L for Portland. They got Kevin Knox and five second round picks for Gary Payton, who they signed and he didn't play. He played two games for them. Detroit, I I give a a B minus B. Okay. Atlanta, C. Okay. And Golden, Get, State. Golden State, I give them like a B plus or an A minus. I think it's very good what they have got. Go ahead. Uh, for that Detroit, trade individually. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. I'll give them a B. Wiseman has potential. Mm. He's really good. Uh, Atlanta, he, I mean, like, they got another person taste like the other people. <laughs> you want to say A-plus for sure. This guy's a... A-plus. 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 Yeah, because they God, gave I'm out... such a dick right now. Yeah, sorry, sorry. He's going to say. He's going to say. <laughs> they gave, they, he's a bona fide reason as to right. the championship bonafide. last year. Bonafide. Keep it going. Keep it going. <laughs> and Portland, I don't care. <laughs> okay. Yeah, they say L for Portland. Yeah. I'm going to give yeah. Detroit B-minus. Just because he has potential, but they also got centers there already. <laughs> Sadiq Bay uh, to the Hawks, B minus. I think he just gives you more depth, does the same thing. He's a good player. Could also flip him later if you ever want to trade him or John Collins. If he gets traded, you got someone to do stuff that he does. Yeah. Gary Payton, uh, A minus for the Warriors because, like I said, you he didn't have to learn anything. He just hops in the system, <laughs> knows how to play with these guys. Definitely. And their main weakness was defense, and he's the, like he's the defense guy. Excellent. You guys, uh, Golden State, I give them an A minus. A minus mostly because there's a lot of picks, but it was a trade. Mm-hmm. Uh, Detroit, I give them a C, and I give the same for it. Because okay. they both got shit that they really. Yes, I see that. All right. I see. Um, Detroit, I'm going to give them like a C. Okay. Because they're not like him anymore. It's <laughs> you don't, don't have to. But he ruined for it. That's his guy. You got to the Hawks. I, I'd give them. I give them a B just because I like City. Okay. I facts. Facts. A, I think he's a good player. Like he does do a lot of the same shit, but like grinder. So. Okay. But like, um, then the Warriors. Truthfully, I mean, I would give it like, I say a B plus just because of what Hudson said. Like, they really did. Just, like he he basically is their second. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. so the value itself yeah. is like, like, I'm, it is good that they got him back. And obviously it's like easy fit, like fit into the system, whatever. But like, at the end of the day, when you look at the value of like that, like the whole trade, like you're really getting a second pick. You know, you know what I mean? The funny like, thing is, though, like, pick away for Gary if, the, if the season started, James Wiseman's value would have been super high to trade him. Because of what they projected Warriors to be. They settled an asset. But hey, tomorrow, they waited. Anyway. As they should have, though. They thought Wiseman was they in. They took the risk. That's what you're going to get. It's like sometimes it pays off and you, you he grows in value. Sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. Of course. All right. Next trade. Had to. Had to <laughs> sad to see my boy go. At Bev. <laughs> second round pick for Mo Bamba. That's yeah, around like a hole, bro. That's Six, seven. Don't, don't, don't talk about him like Minnesota. that. Don't talk about him like that. Don't talk about him like that. But y'all saw that tweet, right? When D-Lo came back, he said, what did he say? Oh, no. Gang said, back uh, together. Back, gang. Welcome back, gang. Hours later, <laughs> ten hours later, boom. Out he of also said some shit about uh, oh, oh, Woj Dang. or Shams. Giving, Woj giving Shams yeah. the work, and then Shams broke his trade. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh my god. How many times has the uh, Patrick Beverly been traded this year? This year? No, this year, just once. Once. No, we got this traded. Uh, any um, 
got traded from Minnesota to the Lakers this year. He was actually year. he went from Minnesota to Utah to the Lakers. Went to Memphis to, too, to, right? To, to, no, he didn't. He didn't go. To oh, that was last year. Man's been around. No, he's in, he's never been to Memphis. I don't think. No, he got traded for Memphis. I remember. No, so oh, he's never been to Memphis. He, he's he your, hasn't he, got bought out. He's twice. your enforcer so he type build that you like so much. No, he never got bought out twice. Trust me. I'm, I'm, I know he got traded from the Timberwolves. It, it either is to the Jazz or the Timberwolves, to one of those teams, Timberwolves, from the Timberwolves to the Jazz. Then he got traded to the Lakers for THT. Then he got traded to right now to the Magic, and he's going to sign with another team. Uh, he's going to be a buyout candidate. You're not going to see it here, yeah, because he well, never played for them. Yeah, huh. But I'm, I, I know for a fact, maybe he got That's what four, five, maybe he got traded like year? maybe he got traded to the Timberwolves, but not in the last year. You know, I mean the Grizzlies, not not the last year. So maybe at some point though, That's four or five trades in one year, huh? Hey, oh, in one year, his yeah, contract's sure. too big for the value he provides. He makes like ten million dollars for a. But he still has value. That's why he gets traded. Yeah, like, an enforcer. He's gonna build. sign with a team for this buyout easily. Yeah. I know it's literally your enforcer. That's the definition. I think he might go back to the Clippers. Fucking... Honestly, uh, he goes honestly, back to Minnesota. That's an easy. That's an easy salary hack. Nate. He's going he to Minnesota. Keep keep out or, out. or he should go to Phoenix, bro. Keep getting bought out. Yeah, infinite bro. money glitch. Yeah. Getting, I like that for infinite them. money. They could use him on a defensive side. CP DeAndre. Oh, CP. I was gonna say he like KD though. He's a clone. He like he like KD though. But I forgot about CP. Yeah, he can't do that. He cannot do that. He's oh, not helping man. CP win a championship. Hell. Oh, no you, fucking. You know we got Isaac. You know we got. I got whole. I know. Shaq, Mo Bamba, Big Shaq takes on Mo Bamba. I mean, Shaq West. We got all the legendary Orlando big men. We got Dwight, Shaq, and now Mo Bamba. He has his own song. That's crazy. He's, he's dude. Oh wow! Look like at the Laker dick riders coming around. Oh my god! Oh, really? song, no, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not right. saying all that. I, I'm gonna give a actual basketball opinion on this. All right, go ahead. He is a downgrade offensively from Thomas Bryant, but he's an upgrade defensively. He's a better shot blocker because Thomas Bryant ain't do shit defensively. Yeah. He's terrible. He's, oh, well, yeah. he's that, concrete that's that's on his uh, cement. Yeah, that's what we need. He, has to <laughs> he can at least block some shots. Downgrade offensively, but he can still shoot a little bit. So uh, I, swap I, it out. He's it's like a, a nothing. It's a neutral think, trait. To he's me. like a family size bag of Doritos. He's pretty good. Like, oh, like you go, you get that. You're pretty good. Ten minutes tonight, he's be good for ten yeah. minutes tonight. You're not playing twenty. You're not he's starting. He's not the snack size. The, yeah. He's the family yeah. size. We At like the end that. Of the year he's gonna be, get, be getting DMPs on the team. I don't think so. You're crazy. Hey, you need to worry about your fucking team, motherfucker. Let him know. Let the Lakers like that, bro. Which team we talking about? Which team is you on? Lakers fans always hype up these guys. Do you have Hustle? How many teams do you have? Getting no minutes. How many teams do you have? Yeah. Mr. I'm Philadelphia, like three, Mr. Warrior. Now Phoenix. Phoenix? He's a kid. Philly, Phoenix. Used to be Brooklyn. Used to be Brooklyn. Now he yeah. jumped off the bandwagon. Really? Phoenix, no. Put it. Name him. Attack, name him right now. Attack all the Lakers. Just now. This man will hop attack. off every team. At least we fans of a, one team. Oh. Stick to it's one like, fucking I'm team. I'm going to say fan warrior. All right. Grade the trade real quick. This is a big long ass episode, but uh, trade. Be expected. Uh, v. Mini, mini w, v. I don't know. V. That's crazy low. That's a C then. Not a W right now. Oh, for Orlando, it's nothing. It's, they're gonna buy him out, right? Oh uh, yeah. So Lakers, basically. Okay, so Lakers, great. Uh, B plus, I guess they get defense. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a B minus. Same reason. B Lakers. minus. I like that. Lakers the trade. Mo Bamba trade. Who? <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm give it like a like a C plus. C. Yeah. Like a C. He'll be. I give it a mini C. W. Mini W. All right, this is a big W trade for the Spurs. Actually, no, it's, it's for, for the Pelicans, for the Pelicans, for the Pelicans. Ah, Josh. Not the Spurs. Spurs took really? a fat L. Well, not really. It doesn't matter. They're a first rounder. Devontae you. Graham. Shot chucking extraordinary. Yeah, Never shot 39% from the field in his career. To the Spurs and four second round picks. There, There's them second round picks for Josh Richardson. Josh, Josh is good. A first rounder for him. No, just four second rounders and Devontae Graham is an ass contract. Yeah. Josh is good. I like Josh. Pelicans W. I think W. Yeah, yeah. I was I was gonna say it's an L for the Spurs, yeah, but they don't need it. They're tanking. It doesn't matter. It, they, 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 they can afford it. Them. They can <laughs> afford his like, contract. They have infinity cap right space. Right yeah. <laughs> they like negative. They like. They is it, wasn't the there like it's like they're twenty seven million cap space, and then the next highest team is like nine million or something, or that's some other yeah, thing they I'm talking about. Too much yeah, I think it's them. I think it's the Spurs. And they also traded Jakob, so they got rid of that contract, bro. It's it's self explanatory, honestly. What would you give it for the Pelicans though? Because they got a player that will play. W. I said W. W. Great. I said W. You could give him a W or a B. Uh, <laughs> I give him a W. All right, next trade. W's in the chat, man. Another good trade for the Clippers. Plumley for Reggie Jackson and Plum a go. pick, second round pick. Yeah, they need another center. Plum go. Jason Plumlee's been good this year. I think he's having career, a career year. Solid trade. They needed someone that wasn't Zubak to play center. <laughs> That's it. Zubak like gets it. foul trouble. It's over. They have Marcus yeah. Morris as the backup center. I like so. it. That's a good point. Moses Brown's their actual. Like, he doesn't play, though. Yeah, he doesn't even play, so. 
I like I like the trade for yeah, the Clippers. Clippers Clippers got a backup center and he's pretty wise. Plumlee's really decent. he's pretty talented, he's bro. Decent. Like yeah, he's he's a talented big man compared to like a lot of big men that can't felt that uh that KD pressure they've been working today. <laughs> he's, he, he the thing is the thing about this Plumlee's one specifically, gonna... <laughs> you want him to get like a rim protecting center, but he's more of like the same thing Zubak does, rebounds, just big body, yeah, yeah. offensive passer. I feel like he's a more uh, he has better basketball yeah. IQ in my opinion. Yeah, wow. I think sure. he does too. But he's not drastically different to Zubak as opposed to you want a shot blocking type yeah. big Thomas Bryant, maybe offensive guy, stretch four. Four, five. So Reggie wasn't doing too good for them Still recently, good. huh? For the shit they yeah, gave up. All George can do what Reggie can yeah, do. Yeah, and Reggie and they got, and they got extra, Bones, so it's yeah. like Bones does the same role. Oh, that's, Bones I like it. I like this. Sport, I like yeah. the Clippers move so far without and what I'm hearing. Bones is younger also and he's under contract and he does the same thing Reggie does, plus you get Plumley. So W Clippers. W Clippers, I'll give him an A minus. Norman's there too. Yeah, so I mean, Norman's just going off the bench over like 18 points per game. It's just crazy. And uh we talked about this. And the uh, last trade I actually didn't mention it. I uh did I skip over it? It was the Eric Gordon trade. The job, I, don't know the, I did not say it. I didn't I actually yeah. don't have it here. This is the one I was missing. That's the last one we got to talk about. It's that one. Yeah. There you go. Three team <laughs> trade. This is a funny one. Memphis gets real shooters. Luke and are going to the Grizzlies. Eric Gordon to the Clippers with three second round picks. Oh, man, hold up. Don't worry about the West, man. We ain't worried about the West. Oh, Don't man. <laughs> Ever since then, every team in the West got better. Clippers better. Lakers better. Even Warriors better. Suns instantly better. <laughs> Fucking the Nuggets got better getting Thomas Mavs, Bryant. Mavs got better. Did you say Mavs? Mavs, Mavs got yeah, better. Yeah, Mavs got better. They're cooked. Except Gazio. Portland. Portland got worse. <laughs> uh, we're not going to be in mid tier hell for like. I think Portland's going to be I actually did a standings prediction. Like, like, New Orleans got better too with Josh. Better. When Zion comes right, back. Let me finish this trade. This is hilarious what the Rockets got from this. First round pick from the Clippers, which is good because. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how Clippers have any picks. <laughs> it's, a swap, it's a swap, so. but that means they gave up their. They already gave up their picks, so now it's a swap pick, so it's now they have nothing. Uh. And they get oh, two no. players who aren't going to see the floor. They're probably not even flying to Houston right now. John Wall, <laughs> Danny Green, they're on the bio. Oh, I didn't even know Danny Green. Wait, what? Team. No way. No, Danny Green did not. Get are you serious? Yeah, I Danny Danny Green Green not He's, hey, come to LA, Danny. We need you. Are you, are you meme? That nigga was on That's the a meme. You know what you think was, was a meme, right? right? Oh. People, people are like, well, they meme like, because you know Danny Green was on the Grizzlies, right? Yeah. yeah. You guys yeah, know this. He didn't play. But everybody memes that Danny, Danny Green still play. played. He played one game. He played one oh, game. He, back, right? he played one everybody game. Everybody meme that Danny Green was like actually in the league. Like, wait, Danny Green's on the Grizzlies? Like for like a joke for like for, like that. three months yeah. for a while until they he played and now he's gone. Basketball. <laughs> That's insane, dude. He's like, Danny Green's in the Grizzlies? No way. I forgot, dude. Shit's crazy. For this particular trade, I'm going to say it's fine. But overall, the trade deadline, they took an L. I think it's. Uh, we, yeah. Let's we can move to the great. This is the only thing trade. they did, right? The only move they the made. Only move they made. That's it's not good for them. That's not good. Team, for, team dude, not they're playing like John Conchar behind Desmond Bain, bro. Like Luke Kennard's a good fit for them. I was about to say they. Are, they. I mean, it's whatever. It's like their team not gonna is good. The so it's like at the end of the day, it makes it better though. A little, a little bit. So they probably seat. felt good. Like yeah, they could have got Aaron Gordon too. I think they're fine in the West. You're about to say right. They're fine. You saw how they felt. You saw how they felt. Job probably felt. Same way that the fucking front office did. They probably was like, we're, we're straight with like our team. Because their team is like, they're it not gels straight. well. They are not straight. No, obviously they're not straight. But I'm saying like, their team gels well. Like, it's not like they were sitting here thinking like, oh, we need this piece and we need this piece. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, he's right. What do you they need? You they do got do? Luke Kennard, which is something that they needed. Should've got KD. But it's just like, it's just the fact that they everybody got so OG, much better that now it's yeah, like, that okay, <laughs> like, what the fuck? Like, got, uh, OG would have been crazy for that. KD, D-Buck, Harry, Luka. Now you got John Morant. They have, no, they have no wing defenders. Oh God, Dylan Brooks ain't guarding KD, and they have no backup to guard him. Zaire Williams, it, that's that's why OG would have been big for them, bro. OG uh, was actually defending. They gotta give up a good amount. Desmond yeah, yeah. Bain's okay, isn't he, defensively? KD. Uh, I mean, he's, <laughs> oh, he's good on guards. Like, he guard yeah. He's Devin okay, but he's not OG. He's, he's not OG defense, bro. It's good KD, OG. bro. It's KD. But they have pieces, oh, no bro. They got all those KD. guys on the bench. Zaire Williams, those guys they drafted. At the end of the day, it's going to be on, on Jaw. He's going to be the reason they win or lose. So. I mean, he they said, not he said they fine, but now it's What about like, Jaren? You're just forgetting Jaren even plays on that? All-star, all-star. Yeah, they got two all-stars. You guys got two all-stars, bro. Lakers don't got two all-stars. Playoffs is not going to do anything yeah. <laughs> Them niggas is like he. It went from like yeah we fine in the west. It was like how you doing? Like I'm fine. Shiver me to I'm fine. Ever since nah, nah, he's like he's like I'm ever fine. since the Shannon he's Sharp like, incident, they, they, they were on a like, mad losing streak after that. The Shannon Sharp like fight. It's gonna be like a top seed in the west. Bro. Yeah. Once the playoffs comes, like we gonna see. We gonna see. Nah, so I'm saying they're gonna be in like mid tier hell. Like like they're gonna be like 
Mid tier, they're, they're upper well, tier though. They're upper tier right now. I'm saying easier. They're gonna KD get like second rounded like, every KD single year. Once KD gets older, they'll still have their young team. Like they're young as hell. Yeah, like, no, I'm got, saying they're like, gonna be next year for a long years. time. Funny thing is that they might the next like, few years they're getting second rounded every year. State. They're gonna play a tough team in the first round. Dude, I think they could lose. Second round is their max. If they meet the Lakers in the first round with this new team, if they gel well, I think Phoenix might be a first round because of where they're where they're now. back to maybe, but I think they're gonna get it rolling. They're too good. Um, w for the yeah. Clippers, though. Eric Gordon. This yeah, whole trade deadline really was, was going back to the old teams, bro. Like John Wall back to the Rockets, D'Lo back to the, the Lakers. I love the I love the Check out this quick I edit. Eric Gordon. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> huh? Yeah, he was nice as fuck. Yeah. Gary Payton Orleans, back too. to the Warriors. All these reunions. Yeah, yeah for real. Well, John Wall talks smack on a podcast about the Rockets. He's not going. And yeah. then a week later, bro, this guy's back on the Rockets. Washington, welcome John Wall back. Think so, bro. They need a guy like him that can help them. Honestly, Man, not I, really I, I like that. I like that's that. That's not like bad, yeah. Him and Bradley Beal. You're a Washington fan. I forgot. Another team, Isaac. <laughs> oh. He's the Washington Wizards the fan. NBA, the Bullets. Man. They also yeah, got Rick Horton. That's the ball, the ball handler. God damn it. They, they got rid I think you should go back yeah, to Washington. I thought Westbrook was going to go there, but yeah. now. How's it handled, boss? What? Yeah, I think he's going to Clippers, too. Paul George won him there. All right. Any. Okay, this is. Those are all the trades. We want to grade or just have winners or losers. Not. We already graded these. Top winners or losers. Three top winners, three top losers. I'm gonna give one loser off the rip, um, because I know you guys are probably thinking about this. It's a lot three, but he instant loser. Yeah. They did nothing. Uh, yeah. Still got Duncan Robinson yeah. contract, dude. You you tell me they couldn't call. That they couldn't yeah, call yeah. Utah. Yeah, like I know I'm happy we got Vanderbilt, huh? but they couldn't call Utah and give up a protected like, first just for like Vanderbilt. Oh, for like, you know nah, what I mean? Nah, nah, nah. They're not doing that. Utah. I don't think they will. First rounder, how far is Vanderbilt going to help them in that? No, but I'm saying they need so. a, they need anybody, bro. They don't have a power forward. Caleb Martin starts at power forward. I think they're, they're kind of like shackled. What can they really do? Dude, they really they they round picks, that like, dumbass they're, money. they're getting players for second yeah, round yeah, picks. Second Something, round. anything. The second rounders, Ty Lowry's on a team. The terrible contract. The second rounders would have helped yeah. him a lot. He um, could play the, he, then you can move him to the four. He could play the stretch four. Yeah. Like, that Duncan contract, though, they're, they're not getting rid of that. So that's such a swindle, that bro. Game. Like you just stop shooting. They like, lost players. They gave away Dwayne Dedman too. Like they. Oh they yeah. Small trade, but it does nothing. I was like, gonna say the Bulls though, Bez. Who? Losers. And the Nets. Yeah. They're they're losers too. I, I predicted that. I predicted them like gonna either make like a push or like blow it up. They did none. They just stuck there and. I don't know what they're. I don't know what they're trying to do. I, I think they took an L. We're saying Zach Levine is unhappy there, like right before the deadline. And then now he's. Still... Too. I think he's on his contract. But they said the players are siding with the coaches though. What is they're, this? They're side. They're not. There's like Billy Zach Donovan's Levine. Not a terrible coach. Yeah. They're saying Zach Levine has like issues with something Billy Donovan. I'm not too sure, but the the players are siding with uh Billy. Yeah. But, they had a, like. A, and they didn't get rid of him. Like Russo still there. They still they didn't do nothing with Drummond. They I didn't know, do nothing Bons with. Play another game in his career. <laughs> Kobe Ooh. White's up for a contract. It's a ball. Yeah, oh, Kobe, White. Kobe White's a good player. They didn't, they, he, like, what are they gonna do with him? Yeah, they sign him. Like, he's not gonna do anything. But it's like you didn't tr- get any value for him. I think you'll <laughs> they got those sumo too, so I don't even need Kobe White. I mean, they kind of need him now that Lonzo's fucked. I forgot a lot. Dude, is he actually not gonna come back like dead ass? He might no, never play basketball. Like, it's like not. Reg- it's not like. Well, it's not like. We don't uh, know. We don't know right? That, yeah. They say it's not healing right. Yeah. That's so what. Yeah, they're like not healing right. It's crazy. And that, he's a big part of their team. Like, he's the reason they were so good last year. He's like blue. He's supposed to make everything work. He's a really, he's a, bro, he, like, he helps a lot, bro. He helps a lot. He he leveled up on that too. Damn, man, yeah. it sucks. But not just like he was a former Laker, but in general, I like Lonzo from yeah, back like then. Lonzo. Not seeing the plays like, like bum. I, like I like it, bro. He's, he's, not, like, too, like, brash. he's not. Last loser is um, Raptor. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I was gonna say him too. Another one. Same situation though. They didn't. We don't know what their direction of the team is going. They didn't do shit. They just stayed. They got Pirtle. They got a lot of free agents too. Trent, OG. Trent's not staying. Fred, OG Fred, goes. Gary. Fred. Fred they they got nothing for all those guys. Yeah, That's the biggest loser. In I'll say this though. I'll say this though. Those Ooh, guys, the they're above mid. Those guys yeah, could organ. No, no. But the thing is, those guys, true, yeah, the organization has been nice to them. Like they've done everything for them. So maybe they'll be like, all right, I'll sign and trade with you. But you're still not going to get as much as you can in a sign and trade as opposed to a real trade. Yeah. Is the sign and trade like you're you're trying to send them off good and then people don't no, want to take on their sign contract? Trade, sign and trade is like I'm gonna go here, but I'm gonna be nice to you and give you something back. Yeah. So it's like so I don't do you too dirty. Okay. Katie okay. and yeah. Dilo. Yeah. <laughs> it's like here, here, motherfucker, stop, yeah. stop complaining. You get your max. Or just so you can get salary spot and then trade that spot for like an actual player later. Yeah. Our biggest winner is <laughs> winners. Yeah. I think the, the biggest Three winners, easy winners. I think all Suns in the same the division. Yeah. yeah, all in the same division. The Suns just became Lakers, Clippers, instant, Suns. Uh, they came, the Suns became winners. instant like title con- yeah, like yeah, title Clippers. favorites. Yeah, Suns at the, the top. I would, say, I would say Suns, Lakers, Clippers yeah. in that order. Well, 
That's not. They did one move. Like, uh, if they did more, I would agree with. But you. Uh, you have to look at this overall. Like, like they gave Obviously, up a defender yeah. for a very su- offensive superstar, so their defense is lacking. We'll see what happens. The bio is going to determine. The Clippers and the Lakers they revamped their team into getting way better. Yeah, than they were. No, dude, the Suns and Lakers are completely different teams. Yeah. Now. Like, yeah. completely. The Suns and Lakers, for sure. The Clippers is the one I'm like, yeah. Yeah, Clippers is just they got better players, but their team is not drastically different. It's still going to be mostly like. Same that's what I'm saying. Like, it's still not. It's like none of those like, guys are starting really. Yeah, maybe Bones, point. maybe Bones, but you know, Eric Gordon off the bench, Plumley off. The I want to see the Lakers like next month together. I want to see what Ooh, we do. I, I want to see what we do. Start watching the game. Start watching yeah, the game. The Suns and okay. Katie Flay. How about you hop off your knees, bro? What do you mean, the su- <laughs> bro? Get out of here. Nah, we gotta see how D looks. It's, it's gonna be Can't fun wait. to watch them though. I do want to say. Gotta see Beasley cook. Gotta see all these guys. Oh my god. NBA players on yeah, the roster. Players, yeah, for real. <laughs> Not fucking D League, like, yeah, G League motherfuckers. They belong in the NBA. Like, who do you think the starting lineup's gonna look like now, Best? It's gonna look nice. Yeah, we for the Lakers. About that. Who do you think the Lakers I'm starting thinking, lineup? I'm gonna say D'Lo mm-hmm. at the one. Easily, the, the, the three locks are D'Lo, Braun, and AD. Okay. And so around D-Lo. them, it depends what we want to do. I would, I would start uh, Beasley, Beasley after, yeah, and say. then Vando for the defense. Okay. That's my that's my exact that's not, same. I would not mind I would not mind uh, a Beasley coming off the bench or Vando coming off the bench and then putting in a uh, Rui. I think Schroeder's a better Rui. Ooh, the four? That yeah, Schroeder has to come off the Schroeder's bench. Schroeder should be Schroeder's a backup point guard for sure. He needs, he needs to have another six man. He'll be a little time. shy, bro. He's good. I think, He's I think yeah. Vanderbilt's a better makeup to start, but Rui's a better player, so they might just start. He fits more for spacing, but if you might maybe maybe they want to go with defense because depends on the team. You don't have defense. With depends D-Lo. on the game too. Yeah, Malik is mid at best. So it's like if you want more defense, you start Jared. If you want more like of the spacing, you start Rui. No, we'll I just see. hope they got options. Though. I just hope we no make right now. substitutions during games. No more games. three point guards. Oh, no more four guard lineups. No more <laughs> more. like bro. Dude, if we make five actually, guards that one. I got they upgrade. Did. I got upgrade the Mo Bamba trade just because they got rid of a point guard. Yeah. <laughs> so now Darvin Cam, even if he wants to, he can't do it. I just wish we our substitutions <laughs> and our like and our and our like play like. Fuck, I don't know what I'm saying. I hope our substitutions are good for like during these games, bro. Because if, yeah. if if this motherfucker playing like four guards or th- okay three guards and like, oh, bro, I'm gonna get pissed. I'm, uh, I'm gonna get heated. I think right, we have see. better options now. Yeah. We, but, I we swear, Darvin Ham, please don't fuck it up. Don't fuck up the rotations. Um, that's the deadline. You wanna say anything about the, the Suns winners or is it kind of self-explanatory? Yeah, so I, I have the same answer as you. KD. KD. You guys got any KD. other winners? KD. You know who I am. Say it. Uh, say it one more time. I'll say it. 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 Did we say for losers, trailblazers? They got to be losers. Oh, yeah. Uh, they're, they're not top three, though. They're not top three, but they got to be. They're on the loser mention bracket. Loser. They're on the loser bracket. Yeah. Honorable <laughs> mention. What are they doing, man? No, they, honestly, no. Honestly, I want to make them worse because it's one thing to not do nothing. It's another thing to just get like, worse. Do shit worse. worse. Yeah, yeah, like you yeah, just yeah. Can, consistently got worse over every trade. Each yeah. trade can't happen. You like, you just got worse again. Like, yeah, it's, like, <laughs> it's like, so that's why I'm going to give them a worse grade than the other niggas who just didn't do shit. Yeah, like, at least the Grizzlies. Yeah, it's like you stay pat. Yeah, like. They got better defensively if you want to say that, I guess. But they also yeah, gave up better. Actually, yeah, I want to say rotational yeah, yeah. players. Getting defense, getting better defensively see. to like get Check a nigga who literally can't. Don't run from the grind, Dame. Don't run. I checked this. Uh, I don't Please know where I saw that. <laughs> Josh Hart <laughs> played the fourth most, fourth Ooh. most minutes on the team. So they got to get that. He played like thirty-five minutes a game. Yeah, You're not playing Matisse thirty-five. Ooh, You're not, not playing Cam Reddish thirty-five. Like, so, see. Keon Johnson. Good we'll luck. Let's we'll see what that defense is gonna do for him. <laughs> The 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 bully the thigh the thigh We can wrap this up. I got a I got a viewer question. Huh? Um, I got a viewer question. Oh shit! You guys answer it. Yeah, sure. Already covered all those things. Oh, quick question: The yeah, Nets. You think they can still make the playoffs without yes. the? Yeah. The yeah. play-in. Sorry, play-in. I don't. Yeah, say yeah, yeah, yeah. I still think they can. Long way. Can the roster? Compete in the thing. They already down, have a kind of head like, start because of yeah, how good they were with KD. Yeah, that's it's they, it's just that they versus like Bucks, Sixers, any of those guys, they're going to no, get first no, rounded. They're not doing shit in the playoffs. They're, they're getting they first rounded immediately. I'm just wondering if they could still make it or they're going to fall off so makeup. bad. They have a really good defensive team and if people know their roles, yeah. they, they have to figure out like I agree. They still got shooters and they got defenders. I mean, they need one guy to like be the guy now, but I don't know. I say they win enough games to stick around. That's all I'll say. What if Cam Thomas actually becomes that dude? Like, I know he. Okay, okay, listen. No, no, no. Listen, oh, listen. No. I know he, he dropped mega like games recently. What do you just average like a cool twenty five the rest of the season? Cool yeah, twenty five. It won't God. translate to winning. He, he's too yeah, tunnel yeah. vision. Wait, who? Can't handle Cam double teams. Yeah. The bucket. I mean, yeah. I was about to say, it won't translate to winning. Ball. But he could be that guy. Twenty five plus is great. The type of really baskets like. he was like shooting is like they're terrible. Illinois shots. Oh, shot. you think Jalen Green shot, type? Jalen Green type. All right, viewer question. Viewer question, Omari. You guys answer truthfully, okay? Yep. Yes, sir. Uh, We're going to order? What is this? What no, kind no, of question no, is this? I'm a lie. <laughs> All right. So, 
they said. <laughs> what? If this is my booty holes, I'm yeah. walking around. Yeah. It's not, it has to be. not about booty holes. Has to be. Not if you don't want it to be. <laughs> I want it to be. <laughs> if you were a baddie for a day, <laughs> who would you smash and why in the NBA? If I was, if I was a, a baddie. Yeah, yeah, I'm not yeah, a baddie. That's scary. That's scary. Oh, I'm gonna actually answer. Can, can I pick LeBron? LeBron? Can, can I, I pick LeBron? LeBron? Tell me, tell me, tell you, Bray. Tell you, Bray. Would you base it off of looks? Like no, they're, no, their greatness. The club, the the club, club LeBron you know, like, is, is like, the That's why and why. Like, what we, you know, what I mean? LeBron. LeBron, we schlong. never, we never like knew about his public <laughs> scandals. Even if are you? Him. So if I'm, oh, if I'm a baddie, that's what I would say. That's what I would say. That's what I would say. They on such shit. Yeah, that's the ultimate dick riding. He said Levine because he likes it. I ain't like that. Who said that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's what I What I said? I'm a Ben Simmons. Levine because he likes it. Oh, I didn't say that. Kelly Oubre, Kelly Oubre. I'll say Kelly Kelly. Oh, stop. Tsunami <laughs> Poppy. I didn't say because he's light skin. What about you guys? Poppy? Hey, no, homo, he's a good looking dude. Come on, man, I'll be honest. This, no, because you, you gotta, like, is it, is it looks? Is it looks? Is it the greatness? Only answer, what'd you say? Looks is it greatness? Like, why? You, you know, who and why? Kobe. But he's, that's necker no, 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 bro. You, like, what? You, 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 you got you have to be present. Yeah, he's gotta be, it's gotta be a real life player. I don't wanna go first. Zach Levine. Levine. We already we said, said We said LeBron. Everybody said LeBron. I, I said Zach Levine. Right, so yes. you said if, if I'm a baddie, yeah, yeah you're a baddie. For somebody like, you're trying to trap him. You got your choice. Are you like going trap. for the? I'm already a baddie. You going for the nigga who thinks he's fine? Are we trying to trap, trap him? Whatever you want. You going for the nigga who thinks he's fine? You going for Washington? He's easy money. I already know I got him. You think he's going to stick with the with the with the best D? Yeah, you going you going for the very poor. See, Ooh, LeBron is a good trap. I Jordan like Jordan Poole. Because you know he's going to bust. LeBron is nutty. unrealistic. What? You're not trapping LeBron James. I'm sorry. I know, but I'm... But like... Nah, but yeah, yeah, when you, the cloud you're going to get... That's, that's yeah, legendary. You are you smash him? Drake. Who cares? No, but LeBron's nah, different. But LeBron got uh, no scandals. Drake so be smashing different. bitches publicly. LeBron JP. don't smash no one publicly. JP, 100%. They won't, so they won't JP. believe you then. 100%. No, but uh, okay, we're assuming against belief. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It has to be. He's I'm assuming we get belief, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm assuming yeah, yeah, yeah. we got belief. Like, it's it. if you would expose it. Blake Griffin. Nobody said that. He just said it. Nobody said that. No, why did he say it? Nobody said that. I'm getting backs up. No, but we got to clip that. Nobody said that. Why did he bring it up, though? He said, I'm going to go to like these. Like, I'm getting, getting clapped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need proof. Yeah, hey, you yeah, you do. I'm with him. Hey, 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 I'm with him. One guy that's Nick Cannon. Oh, Tatum. Tatum has no. Yeah, there's one. John Morant. Who has a lot of money? TJ Washington? No, but he doesn't have money. He doesn't have money. Yeah. Wait, Jason money, Tatum does not have, does not have, have one kid. Go find Kelly Beale Oubre has some kid. A lot of kids, right? <laughs> better go find Beal or Dame. <laughs> or you got to find a dumbass. Nah, that's going crazy on Steph. Nah, nah. Same, oh, same reason for the bro. Hey, man, if I find out Steph went crazy. Oh, he's going on crazy on KD too. I, I can't ruin his legacy. Nice, Chris. He's, he's, he's going like, to the Phoenix Suns line, line, bro. He joined the Phoenix Suns slop top yeah, team. I'll probably go. He, 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 he right there with Selena Powell. I'll probably go Devin Booker. Not gonna lie. Damn, why? Because he has fine? a bunch of kids. Nah, I didn't say all that. <laughs> <laughs> but you did though. But you did though. Yeah, he was thinking. You'll right You're publicly. Not Would you take the team? He'll be a good guy. What about Ben Simmons? Would you right publicly? Like one girl. Would you take the team though, Lusty? Would you take the team? What team would you take? No, 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 no. How about that? Hey, that's a good question. That's, that's a good question. Cut the podcast. That's a good question. That's a good question. Where white boys at? Where the wolf? Thank you for watching the Bottom Line podcast. We out. I want to end it. I got to do the Katie dance. How do you have a party? Oh, yeah. I just want to. I just want to. I just want to. That's what I want to do. He said, hey. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Nah, Jesus. Crazy, hey, thank you guys for answering the viewer questions. Where did you get Feel the viewer question from? Did you make it over? Ben Dead ass. Ask me to ask you niggas. <laughs> so not hey, thank you, Lana, for the viewer questions. If anybody else, I don't like the question. Have a viewer <laughs> question. <laughs> Go to his Twitch. Go to his Twitch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Come back to Twitch. Find me on Instagram. Whatever. Any more questions? The W. Nah, we good, man. Actually, let me double check. Let me double check. Uh, if I got anything on the. Yeah, yeah. Ask me. I'll answer any question. What's any? Uh, any question? You take some dick? No, but <laughs> I had a list of buyout players. I can name them. The, the, the players that were going to get bought Ooh. out. Where they're going to go? 
No, no, no we don't know what they're going to do. But just the players that <laughs> will get bought out. It's a lot of names, though. That's why I said that. Like, so, give me the top five or top ten. I'll say Westbrook. Pat, I'm just going to name them. You can talk about them after I'm done. Okay. Uh, Westbrook, Patrick Beverly, Danny Green, Reggie Jackson, Will Barton, Kem Birch, Jay... Cr- uh, no, no, he's not. Dwayne Dedman, uh, Gordon Drogic, Drummond, um, Justin Holiday, Serge Ibaka, <laughs> Kevin Love, <laughs> Nerlens Noel, Chinese Kelly <laughs> Olynyk, Derek Rose, Terrence Ross, John Wall. Derrick Rose. Rose. A lot of players. Oh, Derrick Rose. Rose. Ross, Drummond. Is Kevin Love right? will be good. Russ could belong on the team. No matter what anyone Kevin says, Russ will be good. Kevin Love to the Lakers, player, baby. Yeah. Yeah. K-Love back with LeBron. LeBron. Love anywhere will be good, Wait, K-Love? Yeah, he's going to get back. Don't, don't go to the Celtics. Back on the Lakers? Not that. Anybody would be crazy. Love is still playing. He plays good. He's a good leader player. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, no, I was listening to it. Well, Barnes is probably going to go to the Suns, I think. Fuck. Reggie, too. He said Reggie's going there. K-Love should go to the Suns. Reginald. Don't say shit like I don't, that. I, but it's a good fit, no, though. Don't, don't speak that in air, bro. <laughs> I don't want him to happen. Hey, yo, don't do that. Never mind. Russ, go to the Suns and fuck shit up. <laughs> uh, I don't think you like CP either. Man, I'd even buy my Russ jersey, bro, for the Lakers. You don't spot. like KD? Who? So he's going to play with KD again? Yeah, of course. Why not? It was, it's in the past, bro. The different league. We'll wow. see people doing the same thing. Do you remember the space, what it was like when, when KD left and it was like the Warriors versus Thunder? Oh my God. The atmosphere was like... Series, oh, bro, it was crazy. And then Russ got a block on KD. She was crazy. Last time Russ was loved. Bro, Mark was like about to cry that day. For no, right. I don't think everyone he was. was so hyped for Russ. Like, <laughs> everyone would like love that nigga. Like, oh, like, shit, yeah. I'm KD. I remember I was watching that game. I was, I was, never, fan, to be real. I was never a fan. I was, in, I was, never I was forced fan. to be a fan because I was like, oh, he's on my team now. But other than that, I ain't Still even. a player, though. Man. I, agree, yeah, I, agree, I, agree, I, can't, I can't take that away from him. But I was never a fan of his game. Like, yeah. I'm familiar with your game like that. <laughs> Yeah, half I am. Half the league's really gonna be in China on that bio list, so we know your game. You can't fool us, Josh, for sure. Drummond not even going to China. He's going to like Taiwan. <laughs> hey, last game he won it against the Spurs. He single-handedly <laughs> took over in the twenty fifteen game, the twenty one fifteen hundred percent from the field game. Yeah, that shit was crazy. He took over in the fourth <laughs> quarter, bro. I don't know it on my feet. It's like Andre Drummond twenty one points, fifteen rebounds, hundred percent from the field. I was like, what the? <laughs> what the twenty fifteen? It was like twenty one quarter. I was like, what the fuck is the twenty sixteen stat line? Because that's like a twenty sixteen Drummond stat line, like in the Pistons or some shit. I'm telling you, that's why I thought he should be. Yeah, but like, bro, it feels for real. Like betting, it's not betting was like that last year. Drummond was going crazy. Yeah, so hard to Dog was getting like 20, 20 games yeah. every other week, bro. Same with the uh, Sun White side <laughs> when he was going crazy. Oh, yeah. Shooters. <laughs> that guy's, that, he was going crazy for like two years. Oh, man. Fall off of yeah, fall yeah, fall off yeah, we, we got to talk about biggest NBA fall offs because there's a lot of people that just died. Michael Carter Williams. Right, next, yeah, next, next, a lot. Even recent players, too. Say that. Write it down for the next one. I like that. I got work, man. Say in the chat. I spoke a challenge. Michael Carter Williams. He had like four holes next to him. But he got a son when it was hot, Michael Carter Williams. Yeah. The LeBron one was funny. His scream was hilarious. Like it broke the mic. <laughs> like, I gotta find my clip. Well, find it later. There. If you can read a page of this, oh yeah. my god, <laughs> was that fifty? Oh man, <laughs> he said the eyes to push the eyes away. Yeah, let's read a full page. Every part of the book, every part of the book, nigga. I'll donate the money. You don't even gotta put the eyes. That was hilarious. That was funny as fuck. Yeah, fifty cents a legend. Right, it's 50, I'll, man. I'll it's 50, it, man. man. All right. All right. All right. All right. That's good. Thank you. Damn. Thank you guys for watching this long special <laughs> trade deadline episode <laughs> of the Bottom Line Podcast. I think we had a good episode overall, <laughs> honestly. Sir, yes, sir. Good one. Good setup, too. So uh, let us know. What let us think. know. Yeah, let us no know what spirit. jerseys you want back here, too. I got a few. But thank you for tuning in. See you on the next podcast. Peace. Love you all. Good luck for your basketball teams in the second half of the season.